Oh, I should get dice. Yeah, you should. Yes, you should. Dice? Dice. The D &D? dice in this no. game? No, we don't. Guys, we don't need dice. We're just drinking and being depressed. Why would we need dice? True. We'll be making constitution saves every two seconds because we're drinking. Also true. Also true. And we're going to drink some magical things that we're going to need to make, like wisdom or charisma saves or something. Roll a D8, yeah. roll two D10, and then subtract a D4. <laughs> Sorry. What is... What? Do you want your character to die, bro? Gamers? Yeah, I mean, my, my character wants my character to die, you know what I mean? I mean, Gamers, that's true, actually. Gamerettes, and everything in between. Literally. Hey, guys, it is Sunday. We're back for Dungeon Select. Bell's back! Round of applause! For real this time. For real not, this time. Like... <laughs> To stay? Not like one session and then disappearing into the abyss again. No, I have my own place now, so I can. Hell yeah. I can do it. Fucking go. Good to have you back. Belle, we missed you. Thanks. Um, things have been. My... I, I'll do like a, a proper recap since you missed a bunch, probably aren't completely up to speed about what happened. To honor uh, Belle's return, <laughs> I'm going to roll my lesbian d20 dice today. Uh, oh, yeah. Dutch, Dutch, we don't know if it, if we've missed her yet until after the session, because it might be like, actually. <laughs> actually, the socks true, leave. True. Actually, actually, I remembered, I don't like cats. I prefer it when remembered. you were depressed. <laughs> I prefer it when you All right. Be traumatized um, again. Fuck you. Anyway, um, we are back. A uh, little bit of an announcement before we get into things. Uh, next week, we'll do a... Halloween one shot, uh, DM by Laura. Um, which also, at the same time, raising money for charity. Laura will be able to ah. tell us all about that in just a second. Um, <clears throat> other than that, er, uh, for, for the foreseeable future, uh, we should be good to just kind of get back into the swing of things like we have been the last few little bits, with the ex exception being last week. Because of some, we, we just basically, with news that Bell was going to be back. Um, we figured it might be better to just kind of postpone the downtime sesh. And I wouldn't have been here last week. Either. And th that too, I guess. <laughs> sure. You know, no, uh, to basically postpone this, this session of, of downtime because Kess needs to be brought up to speed. And from a narrative standpoint, doing that while there is downtime is a lot better than not really having the time up to time. properly catch Kess up with all the shit that has happened when you're already like on the way to the next like fucking... Crazy, dangerous yeah. suicide mission. Um, <laughs> so with that said, uh, Laura, could you give some yeah. more intel on next week's chat? I team? can. Oh, I can. So we are going to be playing a Halloween-inspired one-shot where a team of arcane uh, ghost hunters will be investigating a haunted arcade. So it's like D&D &D rules and like magic exists, magical creatures exist, but in a modern setting. So like more of an urban fantasy kind of vibe. Um, and we are raising money for the charity Safe in Our World, which is a charity uh, aimed about mental health, about making uh, resources for those who need mental health, both in times of crisis, but also just year round, making them more available, accessible, affordable, all that kind of stuff. Um, and also with a focus on um, those who are chronically online or in the gaming world as well. Since, you know, we all notoriously have such great mental health. I have That's made the campaign already on Tiltify. Uh, <laughs> so if you would like to check it out beforehand or contribute beforehand, I just put the link in the Twitch chat. Uh, there is a poll, donations. I've used this one before, but it made sense because we're on Dungeon Select channel and I was like, why not? There, You can put your donation towards the poll of who is the best Baldur's Gate 3 character. And we'll see if it matches when I last ran this poll on Tiltify. We'll see if they have the ultimate or if it, they've been had their title taken from them. Uh, you can also, your donations will be able to affect the gameplay. You'll be able to give players or the DM advantage or disadvantage and stuff like that. And if we hit, I played the goal a little ambitious. I made the goal 250 pounds because it is a UK based charity. But if we raise 100 pounds, or more, then they're also going to be mailing me a custom. It's like one of those like dice shakers in a potion bottle thing, where it looks like so, a little bottle, and then you can like shake it, and it has a d20, and it rolls for you, like on the bottom. And there's only one to give away. So if we hit a hundred pounds raised it during the one shot, we will all live on camera roll for it, and whoever and everyone wants to take a picture of their roll. Whoever gets the highest roll, post it in their Discord group. We'll get the shaker. If it's not me, I'll mail it to whoever wins, since I have most of their addresses due to wedding things. Yeah, so, <laughs> Laura knows where I live. Should be, huh? and, and you know where I live, so <laughs> mutually assured destruction. Except for Belle, no one knows where Belle. You don't know where I live now. <laughs> uh -huh. 
So that's that is all about the charity. So October 27th, make sure to be here. We will also have a special guest joining us uh, since the theme of the one shot is right up this streamer's alley and like their whole year round uh, like content and persona anyway. So it's funny because that'll be next the week. same special guest will also be joining us in main campaign a few weeks after. <laughs> yeah, there you so go. there's that. <laughs> Uh, uh, and then the second announcement I have that's real quick is uh, I have, well, I say I finished. I didn't. because I, I helped. I did the first phase of the editing and then uh, Sodium Swede, who edits my videos, did the comedic edits afterward. But Sodium the nine year Swede. anniversary highlight YouTube video is finally here and it's out and there's some familiar voices from here in it. You'll hear Dutch, you'll hear Duke in that video. Uh, I'll also put that link in the chat. If you haven't watched it, please do. Not right now. Go put it on your watch later list on YouTube because anyone ever hang out use with that? us right now. Like, genuine questions. Anyone ever use that feature? Yeah, there's over a thousand videos on my watch later list, and I've figured out how to go through So it works really bunch. well. <laughs> I've never used I always yeah. just like, oh, I want to watch that. Open it in a new tab. Oh, Open a tab. Tab. Yeah. Yeah. Just go through my tabs as I'm watching shit. Yep. You know what I mean? I'd have too many tabs. It would stress me out. So. So yeah, those um, are my, those are yeah. my announcements. Anyone else have anything? Um, not really. Uh, I I'm streaming some spooky games as well, guys. If you guys you know remember what that time when that Dutch geek was an actual streamer, kind of <laughs> finally. But you still do I know that? I said it before, but now I'm kind of finally in a place where I, I kind of feel okay to just do like you know the one off two <clears> streams <throat> a week kind of thing. And since it's technically still October, it's you know I'm not too late. Spooktober starts late, whatever, but we'll play, some, we'll play yeah. some spooky games. Maybe, maybe, I'm still debating whether it's going to be the Silent Hill remake or uh, the Resident Evil 4 remake, because I haven't played either. So, uh, we'll see. I'm saving the Resident Evil 4 remake for a charity incentive in the future, because it's going to scare the shit out of me. Resident Evil 4 is not that. I'm going away for like a couple I'm weeks. I'm a baby. So. Walk off the head. I am. I'm jealous. There you go. Just around fucking England, isn't it, mate? A little jaunt. Oh. Jaunt. All right. Hell yeah. Gonna go kiss Craig. Nice. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh, Bell could come kiss you too. Just saying. <laughs> Yo. You could I watch mean, those two. Bell. Craig is far more likely to enjoy that experience. Yo, Bell, you could watch Duke kiss me. <laughs> oh, I'm in. That's there awesome. you go. Like she'd enjoy it more. That, that's, there it is. Ah, oh, Bell, you really miss out on that fucking wedding, man. <laughs> fucking Koi, but he's yelling at everyone that, they'll, that he'll kiss everyone. And he was literally using, people. I'll kiss you next as a threat. Like, yeah. that, it was funny. Fuck. Um, all right. I think, uh, I think that's it. Is it a threat it. or a uh, promise? Both. Both. It's a beautiful both. thing about it, Soka. <laughs> um, all right. So, recap time. Um, a lot has happened. You ventured through the Whispering Woods, met with a green dragon named Shasa, who turned out to be, um, <clears throat> related, shall we say, to, uh, what happened to be your target, uh, Brixoth. Through an adventure through the woods to collect pieces of a key that you would need to enter Brixoth's lair, um, you encountered Brixoth a little sooner than anticipated, and he ended up kidnapping Davian and killing Daigon after also briefly having killed Elazarin before he uh, got bamfed to the Plane of Fire and resurrected <laughs> by Kosuth. But the party was in shambles, with Brooks and Kess out and away uh, doing research for uh, the cure for Kess's dad and, and research of the dragon that resides in their plane of existence. We'll have to fight uh, at some point in the near future. Dragon dead. Davian kidnapped. It was just Lazarin, Jax, and Cinder, Davian's splinter ally, that continued the trek through the woods. Eventually, finding Brixoth's lair, entering it, learning that Brixoth was in fact Valor all along, the Lazarin's orange-skinned tiefling friend, really on brand with the fact that green dragons are very vile manipulators, and, you know, as it showed, uh, the Lazarin had been manipulated by one pretty much since his entire life. <clears throat> um, but... But... 
His daughter didn't vilely manipulate us. True, 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 true. Okay. You were uh, yeah, uh, aided by his daughter in the fights. Uh, you were also aided by a new found ally uh, by in, by the name of Velxinui, right? Fire. Uh, who was basically with the elemental lords missing a water elemental lord because of Istisha's betrayal with, uh, with, with, the, with the, 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 the bitch queen. Um, it seems that there has been a new elemental lord of water uh, has been chosen to represent that plane uh, for the rest of well, eternity, if things go well. Um, uh, Sashelis, <clears throat> uh, a, a, an elemental lord you had briefly seen a sign of when you were traveling the seas towards uh, the Bitch Queen's lair. You got blessed by Sashelis, and his iconography is this little dolphin, uh, and you got got a pin that, that had that emblem that gave you a boon that lasted a week, I think, uh, top of my head. But then uh, there was Thel, who just apparated out of dripping water, um, who aided you in the fight, and has now uh, basically been instructed by the Elemental Lord of Water to be his representative, very similar in the way that uh, Davian is Kosuth's representative, and, and, and Elazrin is uh, <coughs> a representative as well, and Kes, you know, naturally, being the air representative in this uh, in this um, equation. You managed to kill Brixoth, learned uh, a couple of things uh, as well, learned that general, or you found General Kron in that lair, tortured, killed day, day in, day out, resurrected, killed again, uh, who was a shell of her former self, but you managed to save her. And you all teleported back after finding a particularly powerful bow that allowed you to use teleportation magic in the Whispering Woods to use <clears throat> Elazrin's uh, connection to the temple in Kalzir to teleport back, you are now back in the city. And after kind of getting your bearings a little bit, um, relaxing, figuring out what to do, uh, informing Brooks that showed up as well of the things that had happened, basically there is now little bit of downtime for you to figure out what to do, whether you want to pursue um, the Black Dragon or the White Dragon, uh, Nazarg or uh, Pill Cutter, really depends on you. You also did learn, apparently, through some kind of vision, that uh, Nazarg has a vault in his lair that houses some particularly powerful artifacts. Um, and when mentioning that to, I believe, the Empress, she did kind of uh, mentioned that there were these elemental artifacts that went missing eons ago. And she is concerned, given that coincidence doesn't really exist <laughs> in this world. So she's concerned that that might be those artifacts. And if they happen to be used by the wrong people, that could be really bad. Jax also nearly started an international incident by insulting her. Yeah. In <laughs> yeah. Jax did kind of like backhandedly accuse her of betrayal a little bit and she didn't take that well. Yeah, but it worked but, out know. though, so it's fine. It worked out. It worked out. You know, you guys, you guys, you know, she, she basically got forced to open up about being a dragon and then Jax kind of kept prodding and poking and she didn't really appreciate that. But um, she didn't incinerate you right then and there. You were allowed to walk out. So there was that. And now... Mm -hmm. You are about to head to a party, actually. The 100th anniversary of the Hog's Belly. Um, the tavern in Kalzir. For some downtime, some drinks, some fun activities. And some unwinding after what has been a very eventful last, shall we say, week or so. If not more. With that said... As you were all kind of headed towards... I know we kind of separated towards the end and you all kind of reconvened towards the tavern. As you all kind of gather in front of the tavern, you can see that outside there are these there are these, these food stalls, very well decorated. You can hear music coming from the inside uh, through the open windows. And right as you are ready to enter, um, suddenly with a poof of 
a g gust of wind. Uh, Kess. Cheers. Uh, <laughs> a gust when, of wind. I love when <laughs> it's Lee has tears in his eyes, but he's trying to hold it together. When doesn't he? Let's be honest. Well, I know, but like, there's more. It's just it's like shocked to see Kess, and like, it's just mouth open, just like. Uh... I'm back. <laughs> hey, um, heart. Hey, Kess. Perfect timing because I think we're all about to go get pissed. Yeah, we are. Oh, excellent. Yep. How's it? Okay. How's it going? Pretty, pretty good now. And we got like uh, we did a lot of research and went around for the plane quite a lot and had some fun. You can see Celeste your, just kind of like man? Celeste does not know what to say or do. She's just kind of there like. <laughs> sidle over to Celeste and I kind of have a, I'm trying not to like smile because obviously it's a set but I'm also like can't hold the oh that she just said oh things are going pretty good and I'm just like well that's about to change as you and do so like, Celeste like looks at you and just kind of like, imaginary just, popcorn yeah, like Celeste like looks at you and just kind of like whispers like so um <clears throat> is this is this weird should we um should we just go inside and let them uh, be absolutely not I hate the kind of tragedy where all the drama happens off stage. You are horrible. When you've lived as long as I have, life gets pretty boring. You need some things to make some entertainment. Who's this bitch? Hi, uh, <laughs> Folks in a way. Holds out hand for a handshake. Can't Not about <laughs> friends call her fell, but she doesn't have any. Yeah, pretty much. Fascinating. I also you know, assumed of the group, you might be one of the ones capable of the multisyllabic name pronunciation, so. Yeah. Yeah, they're always like. Sorely mistaken. She's a fucking idiot. Have you thought about a new name, actually? You could call yourselves the monosyllables Jax, Brooks, Kess. And one of, one of the non monosyllables is gone now, so it's almost more appropriate. Oh, and then fell that. short. I like. Just a lot. Like. Daggers to that, like absolute, just like. <laughs> she has uh, eyes. Oh, I am gonna so go cast. inside to so drink. Cast. You have. Why is it always me? Because someone else do. <laughs> and Celeste just like. Why are we get a drink? Celeste just first. goes inside, yeah. and is like, I, I, she's leading yeah. you to this conversation. <laughs> We should get a drink. <laughs> and probably that. sit down. Yeah. Okay. That bodes well. Oh, yes. We'll go inside. Why do you look like you're going to cry? inside shortly. Uh, I, I start After. crying. Uh, I'll <laughs> just cry. It's just crying. <laughs> Why is that you're going to cry? Cry. So, <laughs> so you all go inside? Yeah, and after him, like, yeah. someone tells me he's going to be the depressed kind of drunk. So as you enter you know. the tavern, you can see that there's there's a lot of people there. Uh, there are some like booths that are kind of sectioned off, um, most of them being taken. You can see in the corner there's a small stage with a uh, handful of bards all playing some instruments and, and one bard singing uh, all kinds of uh, tunes. The inside of this tavern is completely where normally there would be a bunch of tables. There's been made room for all sorts of activities and games you can see uh people kind of lined up for with a bunch of like pies in front of them waiting for someone to count them down uh similar scene but on the op opposite end of the room where there's a bunch of just mugs of ale lined up and people are waiting um there's a bunch of people dancing uh and there's there's also a few tables where people seem to be playing wrestle alarm other kinds of more physical uh, games. There's a slapping, a bunch of people just slapping each other as well, uh, while standing across from each other uh, with a table in between them. Um, so there's a bunch of bunch of games happening, a bunch of stuff. Uh, the bar is jam-packed, uh, and you can see this, this big sign celebrating 100 years of, uh, of the, uh, this establishment, uh, with the price tags being all ales, beers, and wines, one silver, and all cocktails, five. This is a weird environment. Mm. Is it quite loud in here? It is. Yeah, I know it is. Cool. 
Oh, also, Davian's like six foot four now. Oh, yeah, Davian's six four now. Go <laughs> bring fucking five six king to six. Yeah, he's four. significantly taller. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And he's not wearing like heeled shoes or anything. He's just legitimately taller. Just sick. <laughs> how long have I been gone? Like to me, how long has it been? I looked up in, about like, two no, weeks. <laughs> it's, it's only been somewhere between one and two weeks in our world. Like if time I don't know if time works differently where you are, but yeah, it hasn't been that not long that sense. to be honest. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. You left pretty much right after uh, killed Death Job, right? Yep. I'll find out. I'll I'll scroll yeah, and I'll sure pop Kess back was there in for that point. fight, and then shortly after that, so I was in the nine. Or for which fight? The the death jaw. Death jaw. First dragon. Okay. Like I I left. I'll find my notes about death jaw then, and I'll look at the date and tell you in a second. I'm pretty sure you left right around the time that the party was getting ready to walk off to forest. Because she came with us yeah. like, to, she left Eldalon and was with us when we got to Kelsier the first time, yes. right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Then both yeah, then at max, Ethan... at max, it's been nine days that you've been gone for us. <laughs> yeah, so like six months. <laughs> Not six months IRL, but you know, it is what it is. I already <laughs> forgot how I... It's, it was it something in the Whispering Woods. It was in the Whispering Woods, yeah. You like... It was like a magic effect that just made you taller. Yeah. Like wild magic surge or something. Some, it was, yeah, it was some... Yeah, it was one of the surges, yeah. Magic like someone cast a spell on me, I'm sure. I, but... Yeah, it was a, I think it was a wild magic surge and it just permanently increased Cause, your size. Because Kess wasn't with us when we did that murder mystery with the ghosts, right? Mm -mm. No. Okay, so yeah, it's been like a week. <clears throat> Good. That makes everything worse. I know, right? <laughs> is it so much worse, dude? <laughs> Why does it make it so much worse? Because it just like it's, it's just like been oh, a it's week, been man. it's been like ages. Imagine you go on holiday for a week, you come back, and one of your best friends is dead. Sure. <laughs> like that's that's how bad it is. It's like it's like you've gone away, and it's like hey, by the way, your best friend. But if it was like oh hey. But if you go like, are oh, you been gone for two years? I'm going on holiday and my best friend is about to fight a dragon. And then I came back and they were dead. That's, I would be like, oh, it's probably the dragon, huh? Yeah, but it's still not, dragon still you're not, going to fight. It's still not great, though. You know what I mean? It's still not like a fantastic, like, by the way. But it's not like oh, you just got back from holiday. Yeah, it's like you step off the plane. Oh, your best friend had a heart attack. It's like, oh, you know when your friend was going to fight that dragon? They died. And it's like, ah, that <laughs> figures. Damn. That does, yeah. Yeah, so it yeah, is very loud. Like... It is very loud in here. Um, very busy, very crowded. But do you have a cocktail menu? Absolutely. Of course he does. <laughs> um, well, this is Dutch we're talking about. For real. Do we need to keep track of like how many drinks and stuff we're gonna have today? Like, I'm assuming Dutch, you would like us to. Let's just open a tab, bro. We got money. We got money. We got money. Um, there is a cocktail menu that consists of 100 drinks. Of course. Here we go. And you can choose yeah. to either roll a d100 thing in a random one or... Um, Make another. Well, let's you know. run it up. You know. Well, are we starting at one? I'm I'm going over to the bar first, like, first order of business. So can I, can I roll a drink for everyone and then just bring... A fucking tray of drinks As you over. enter the bar, you can see this 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 taller, uh, well-rounded, shall we say, bit chubby uh, man uh, with a with a very like, it's got like the you know the, the mustache that kind of just links with his fucking uh, sideburns. Like a handlebar mustache. Or like a like proper like just one. Yeah, yeah. It's like one piece, but no beard. Yeah. It's just that stash. One piece mentioned. Oh, hell yeah. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening. Are you here to uh, celebrate? The anniversary. My name is Roger. I'll be uh, your uh, well. I'll be here behind the bar, pretty much on evening and nights, and possibly tomorrow morning as well. What can I get you? I need five drinks. All right. Six drinks. Six. That's seven. Eleven. Hold on. Oh, out quickly, out of character. Are we pretending like Brooks is here and yeah. just like quiet? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Brooks is. Brooks is. Oh, just Brooks is here. Brooks is Seven just drinks. processing the Daigon news. Seven drinks. Well, plus there's Celeste too. That's seven. Yeah. 
Six yeah. of us plus Celeste. Yeah. Fuck, dude. Matt's hard. Okay. Yeah, of course. <clears throat> yeah, you're right. What level are we? You're on 13. <laughs> we are level 13. 13. Oh, okay. I've messed a level up, so... We oh, yeah, we did, like, tag week. you, but well, that's fine. Yeah. It won't it won't be, be important for today, but, uh, yeah, level up for next week, then. Yeah. Yeah. I will I will do that. Anyway. Gonna roll some D-hundos? Yeah. I'm gonna roll two at a time. The fun part uh, is seeing Moody assigns the drinks, too, after he Yeah, that's what I'm off. curious about. A 53. Okay, hold on. A 53. The is okay I, uh, I did i rolled like the opposite of 100 i rolled so a nine 53 you get this big fuck off mug like big like huge almost oh as, like almost just kind of takes up the, the place of the entire like first tray okay there you go. i wish we had like a gnome in the party to give that to a nine nine Oh, okay. All right. This uh, this one is uh, is a lot more uh, you know modest in size. It's just this shot glass filled with a brown liquor. You aren't gonna believe this. One. A fifty-four. Okay. And a ten. <laughs> okay. Uh, fifty-four. You get this very pink looking cocktail in like a tall glass. Okay. And a 10? Yeah. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh. You get a uh, another like small, like basically you get a tumbler with some kind of uh, brown liquor in it. Uh, a 45. 45. It's a fun one. You get a small cup with inside of it this kind of greenish bluish uh, liquid. And a 15. Okay. <coughs> This one just looks like a pint of cider to you. And a 51. Mm. Uh, get you a mug of some kind of ale. Okay, so we got a really big mug, yes. a shot of brown liquor, a tumbler of brown liquor, a pink cocktail, a green blue liquid, a pint of cider, and a mug of some kind of ale. Pretty much, yeah. Um. Uh, I will give the big mug to Brooks. Okay. The Brooks, the Titans Brew. Yeah. A regular tasting ale served in an enormous mug. Uh, and as he drinks it, you notice that he, he dies. goes two inches. Oh. Buddies. Uh, I will give the pink drink cocktail to Celeste. Uh, the, the pink one? Yeah. That was the Paladin's Bane. Sweet enough to tempt the righteous and you hardly taste the alcohol. It will give you a decent hangover and diabetes to boot. Which is a very sweet Hell yeah. drink. And you barely That's a fun description. The, alcohol. the mug of some kind of ale I will drink. Uh, that was 51. 51. You drink Fire Breath Ale. Oh, God. Um, You're the fire boy. This should be basically, fine. Basically, uh, as you drink and you kind of like a little burp, like fire, flames kind of fly out of your mouth, um, you do get the sense that it is a very bad idea to stand near any open flames for the time being. Or a very good one, depending on how I guess, how I guess. pyro technically inclined you are. <laughs> I guess uh, so, number yeah. forty-five, the green blue liquid. I will give to Thel. All right. 
Um, hmm. Okay. Tell you, uh, you, you drink. Yeah. Hell yeah. Make a uh, make a Constitution save. There we go. What is my thing? Thirty twenty. Okay. Uh, you are fine, but you Hell do yeah. manage to let out a little burp. Little burp. As you burp, Lord. you suddenly turn into a sheep. <laughs> As you drank a polymorphic brew. So for the next minute, you are a sheep. That's hilarious. And after a minute, you get turned back automatically. Okay, going <laughs> still in descending order down to 15, the pint of cider will go to Elazrin. Elazrin, you drink... Oh, I chug it. The sun's glory, <laughs> a citrusy cider that makes your eyes glow like an Asimar. Oh, oh well, that's fun. That's fun. Uh, I down it. So I'm fine. for how long? Uh, for a few minutes. For the, for the next few oh, minutes, okay. Lazarin has these like bright golden eyes. Okay. Are my tears also golden? Yes. <laughs> say, just golden down my face. face. Just golden down my face. And when I'm not a sheep, I'll just be like, oh look, and that matches all your shiny money. And that leaves the number right? Number 10, the tumbler of brown oh. liquor will go to Jax. Wonderful. You're going to give Kess the shot? You drink a fairy fireball. A delicious cinnamon whiskey made with a touch of fey magic. Causes uncontrollable hiccups for... Oh, that's the worst. I fucking hate hiccups. Oh, like my D4. There it is. Uncontrollable hiccups, hiccups for the next hour. Oh, that's... Um, that's, that's so shitty. And with oh, each damn. hiccup, a small cloud of shimmering breath is released. So every time you hiccup, there's like a little bit of shimmer, shimmering lights coming out of your mouth. <laughs> and then the shot I will place in front of Kess. Oh, and I will so take good. a seat. Do you drink the shot, uh, Kess? Not yet. Um, God, shut up. She's waiting for them to break whatever news to her, and then oh, she needs true. the shot. <laughs> true. Whatever news. Uh, so, I'm assuming you're now. being really weird because of something happened to Tygen. Crying, crying. <laughs> <laughs> Over the fucking, like, Ouch. rowdy tavern. Yeah. <laughs> well, sort of... <laughs> Fire. Sort of the worst <laughs> kind of something, really. I'm sure you can figure that out, though. I mean, she's it's not... Dead. <laughs> She's not here. So she's gone? Yeah. She said, yeah! Is she, so she's dead. She's dead. Dead. This is really the worst place for you guys to have this conversation. So they yeah. say that while I'm a sheep, and then I unsheep uh, when I finish, and then I was like, well, more dead. She was dead before, but now she's like... Dead, and no, it's, a, it's a classic we say she's dead and it's like the bar goes silent at the perfect time like the music stops and you're like ah yeah. oh, <laughs> yeah, she's dead <laughs> and seeing the like, cast is bothered I'm like I think you're gonna need another one I'll be right back and I'm gonna go up and just get um like a regular uh I'm gonna ask for the most like neutral like, no magical effect, just a straight shot of whatever, like, the bartender has. Like, the kind of thing that'll make you forget about the night you had, but with no magical side effects. Oh, I get two, one for me, one for Kess. We bought, um, lots of things, but, uh, some good old vodka will do the trick, I reckon. Sure. Sounds great. As you, as Tell leaves, uh, Celeste just kind of, like, sidles in next to Kess and just kind of think anyone here likes her just yet so just kind of uh no um mm. just kind of sidles back out and kind of leaves you to your conversation wait how much do those drinks cost again five silver a pop okay dead mm. uh hmm no one I loved has ever died before. What? Stop. <laughs> hey, we're doing this. This is what we're doing. Listen, I'm just living in the moment, all right? We're uh, I will uh, hug Kess, and it's like just a like a 
big sort of embrace. It starts out a hug like this is a hug for Kess, and then becomes yeah. a kind of hug where it's now for a Lazarus he needs support from Kess. <laughs> yeah, 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 like, yeah. yeah. It, it, it starts up being like, I'm so sorry, and it sort of gets a little tighter, and then like the yeah. head goes in the shoulder, and it's like, and she feels ah! the moisture on her, sh on her shoulder. And, I, like, and, like, oh, okay. and then it's like, it goes on for slightly too long, and then like realize I quickly let go, and just like, <laughs> sorry, and then. Yeah, it's okay. Of... It's been a, it's been a, it's been a week. Yeah. So what do you do now? Uh, we. Well, we remember... live in for about a week. Yeah, we're we... really fucking drunk and drunk. celebrate our Have friend. Life. We celebrate Daikon's life, and then we say goodbye, but maybe not. I don't know. And then I return as I'm saying that, like, and I can help with the getting really drunk part. And I put down the two shots, one for me, one for Kess, and go, it's just straight vodka. No magic. You can Wait. save that for later if you want. Lazarin, <clears throat> what do you mean? Okay, I'll take, maybe I'll take the shot. Yeah, they do my shot. <laughs> well, I just rolled a hundred! <sighs> so you, uh, like, you take the, the normal vodka, you still leave the other the shot that uh, uh, you brought for you and still, still have there? Kess kind of just, like, looks directly at Lazarin and it's like, so this is a funeral? A few, well, I believe no, they this call it a funeral. wake. Yeah, this is more the wake. wake. Or at least a celebrate. It's the celebration of life. Yeah. Would call it. So is there something called a sleep? Like a dream? Or is no. it just a wake? No, it's just a wake. Um, I forgot. As in, in, in the wake of Diagon's life. Like a wake. We, like, like, in the, like a wake of a ship. Yeah. Nope. So, I've... Davin, when a ship is Davin, sailing... Davin, 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 no, it's actually Davin. a metaphor. Let him try. You have a look no. to the back of a ship. He has point at Jax. I mean, we all have. We've all been on a boat. And there's like... Yeah. The, the the water sort of, sort of behind it is like kind of... It's, it's sort of like a little tide of its own. And that's called the wake. And then... So that's because it's behind the ship. If Diagon's life is a ship... This is the wake. It's also an apt metaphor for just dealing with the grief as it goes on. Because the first, the immediate part of the wake, right behind the ship, the choppiest, the roughest, the hardest to navigate if you were to cross it on a smaller boat. But the further out the ship gets, the gentler the wake gets, and the more time passes, the easier it becomes to accept. And whereabouts did you hang around before you lured sailors to their deaths? <laughs> the ocean. No ship. Right, but which part of the wake? Well, I mean, I kind of had fun sometimes doing like tricks through the choppy part when I still had a tail and everything. Anyway, That's I rolled a hundred. Okay. What's a hundred? Take another drink. Okay. Yes. Yes. All right. My friend is dead. Good point. You roll. Ooh. Oh God. You roll water. <laughs> you get an hey. ethereal ale. Ooh. The more intoxicated oh. you get, the more you fade into the ethereal plane. After oh. the first drink, you become slightly transparent. After the second drink, objects start to phase through you from time to time. And if you manage to keep drinking, you, enti you entirely enter the ethereal plane. So right now you've right only now had one of these. He's still here. He's just secret. You've had one of these, but uh, so you, you're slightly transparent after you finish this drink. Um, God, that's a bit bleak, isn't it? Well, mm -hmm. for Daigon, I guess, and then I'll take the shot. The <laughs> shot? The one yeah, yeah, the, the, the one you got. Daigon. Um, so for the next hour, <laughs> you drank a drink known as the Squeaker. Uh, for Squeak. the next hour, your, your voice is very high-pitched. Oh, God. <laughs> God. Guys, I'm just Dude, I tried and my mic didn't even pick it up. <laughs> I really, really like the idea of Brooks getting that drink. <clears throat> like, surly, surly, sure all like angry. You <laughs> 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 almost made me spit all over my keyboard. Holy shit. Oh. Oh, me and Koi was fucking Fuck smoke her laugh again. Let's go. 
Yeah, oh, I'm just trying to forget what he said, dude. As you're having no. this conversation, uh, more and more people are coming in, and it just kind of... To the uh, perceptive ones among you... Oh shit, that's me, technically. Some, it seems that, like, more and more people come in, but it doesn't feel cramped at all. Almost as if inside of this tavern kind of expands based on the amount of people inside to always provide the ideal That's amount cool. of space for the amount of people that are currently inside. So sick. <clears throat> That's a genius idea. Imagine you, go to, imagine you go to where your friends are, and then like 20 people enter, and they're just on the other side of the fucking bar, and you're like, what happened here? <laughs> <laughs> and then you come, like, 30 people leave, you come back, and they're back on the other side, because it's like, shrunk all the way back the other way. Like, but, oh, um, yeah. It's a great start to the night. Uh, yeah, I will go to, uh, I like to go to the buggy, and I, uh, can I have, like, two of your cheapest, like, nastiest ales? Oh, Today all ales are silver, so you might as well go for the best ones. No, I want your cheapest, nastiest one. That would what? usually be. He wants to be anti Alasbrin. Right. right. Two. And then also coming up. Uh, perfect. And then uh, I will have one of whatever your most expensive wine is, and then one of whatever your cheapest red wine is. <laughs> May I ask? Some. Uh, never mind. All right, so two piss waters, one, sh <laughs> one shitty wine, and one r wine that is so good it'll knock your socks off. Perfect. Anything I else? doubt it will, but sure. Um, no, that's okay. all. Okay. Yeah. Such a prick. Can I go <laughs> on the other guy's tab? I noticed he yeah. went towards you. Yeah. Yeah. Just put it on that tab. Yeah. I will come to, back with like the the ales you got get given. Yeah. Like it's. There's barely any color to it. Like it is barely oh, like it just it just it's looks for... like water. Fosters, Foster. <laughs> <laughs> I will uh, chug that like one of them, just yeah. at the bar. Not great. Got fantastic, and I'll just take the other three drinks and I'll put them in front of like where I was sitting. Mm -hmm. uh, I will take a sip of like the shitty like red wine. Is it kind of shitty? <laughs> I'll take a sip of like the expensive red wine. How good is that? It's pretty good, man. Really good. I just fuck like, it. I fucking uh nice. I uh, just put the shitty one into the into the uh what? <laughs> into the good one. Are you like mixing I'm mix it? Yeah, I'm mixing oh. them. This is how you know he's on the edge. Oh god, okay. <laughs> just down that, down the piss water, and then just stare at everyone. <laughs> so let's go. Um... There's a lot of games happening. Do, do you guys want to play something? Maybe oh, distract ourselves? Great. I feel like maybe bringing up the topic of Daigon was would have been better before we went here. Um, I don't really know what to do with myself <clears throat> right now. It's very awkward. What? So I I'll be, would like to play some games. I'll, I'll be honest. That sounds like a huge problem. Elijah, should we go slap each other at that table over there? Absolutely. Bet. All right. <clears throat> so as you, <laughs> I put on my big signet ring. That uh, fucked up. Why are you slap? What? It's as you approach it's the uh, the table where the slapping contest uh, is held, you can notice that there is uh, currently two other people as well, and <clears throat> it is a uh, it's a team game. You get explained that uh, contestants are paired and decide who goes first. Uh, that contestant slaps the opponent in the face as hard as he can. Um, mm -hmm. And then they switch roles. So we could be a team. And basically, if one teammate fails, taps out, fucking gets his shit knocked out, that teammate that is left is then on his own 1v2ing, essentially. Um... There is a buy-in of five silver per contestant. A golden name. And um, I brought the round of drinks, so you can yeah, I'll put the gold. pay the gold for this. And basically, it's 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 winner takes winner takes all. Yeah, cool. So right now, so there's two other people, so it's a four, it's a two gold uh, pot. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> I'll, I'll 
Darwin like suggests like obviously we'll start the shit. I was like, we be as a team first, and then maybe. Well, yeah, I mean, find some strangers. Naturally, of course. I will take the big signet ring off. <laughs> whoa, 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 hold on. Surely that will give us the upper hand if we're on. A team. They'd probably say no. Ri I'll ask. Oh, okay, like, is there some sort of organizer? Don't ask. Just yeah, do. And if they tell there you, there is not one guy. To. Oh, you, you here to sign up as well? Uh, we've got is it rings room. on or off. We've, well, it's up to oh, you, mate. Whatever things gives you the edge. Um, Back on. There is a, a max amount of, of eight people playing at the same time. There's currently four. Them two and you two. So if you have any friends that might want to play as well, uh, get them. Uh, I'm starting this in about a couple minutes. See if more people trickle in. I will just sh try and shout across the bar. Any of you guys want to slap the shit on each other? Guys! Guys! What an annoying guy that's always shouting at everybody. Yeah. It's not even like role playing wave. Right now. It's the part. When they're done this Dutch, I have a, a thing fog? for mm -hmm. Thel to do, but this they can finish this little scene first. I assume nobody gives a fuck. <laughs> uh, as you begin screaming, there's this other like duo that kind of just like comes in from one of the corners of the room. You all right then? Uh, yeah. <laughs> and it's this, it's this, like, so the, the duo that was already there are these two dragonborn, both, uh, oh, what's up, <laughs> uh, both red, red scales, um, looking pretty, God, they're green scales. God. pretty brutish, looking pretty wide. And then the two people that approach <clears throat> are these, are these two elf adjacent looking, uh, looking. individuals, uh, looking quite slender. Um, it's, it's, they, they kind of got that, like, sleeper build going on, where it's like, you won't, you wouldn't say that these are pretty, pretty fucking muscular people until they get close, and you look at their arms, and you're like, oh, shit, wait a second, for, like, for, yeah. you know, small frame, but sleeper within build. that frame, there's a lot of muscle. Though. And then they see us two, who have, like, <laughs> zero muscle definition. Yeah. Hey! So they're right. also you see up? a Lazarin who has I zero muscle strength. <laughs> oh, Let's go. true. So, eight. the way this works is... There's currently uh, three pairs, <clears throat> so it's basically winner stays at the table rules. So mm -hmm. we'll begin with uh, your duo and the duo that was originally there. The two elves that yeah. rocked up a little later have to wait their turn. Uh, which one of you is going first? Uh, should we flip a coin on it? Yo, let's just, no, just, let's just both roll a d20, highest number. Okay. I got 12. I got an 11. Oh, yeah. I go, I'll go something. first. All right. So, uh, Elazarin. Got my big old signet ring on. I've got go, all my other fucking first, jewelry on. And like, before you stand, this, uh, this, this, this one of these two red dragonborn. Uh, and he looks at you, and then the, the, the kind of the guy organizing this game just, just looks at you, Elazarin. You get to go first, mate. And the red dragonborn uh, has, like, his hands behind his back and like leans forward and just waiting for you to fucking I'll do that thing where you like you sort of like look like you're sort of like levering it up, you know, just sort of like <laughs> almost touch the face. Yeah. And then like I'll go for a fucking right. go for a slap in it. Make a strength check. No. No. Just a straight strength check. Mm -hmm. What is my dexterity? It's a fifteen. Fifteen? Roll the natural one. I'm a constitution saving throw. Let's go. You slap <laughs> this guy, and you can see his entire head just go. You hear some some like cracking happening in the jaw, and he just is pretty good. <laughs> it's fucking knocked out, gone. I do the, I like I saw two of my bites look cool at Davian, and you just see me go. <laughs> uh, the second uh, dragonborn immediately like rolls up and kind of looks at you and then the the the, the organizer right your turn I'll so lantern i would like you to make a constitution saving throw oh you win you these. win these Ooh. that one baby 15 17 uh so you just get slapped but um yeah you do kind of last second kind of flinch which kind of means it, you 
and face is not in the ideal it's, position and you just it's, get it's, fucking punched like kind of like oh, out of your mouth and put inside of your yeah, nose and it knows, fucking hurts yeah. your nose starts bleeding yeah. um oh. and the contest lead kind of looks at you and just kind of you're all right we're good okay next <laughs> and the uh, <laughs> the elves now walk up to the table, and one of the two elves looks at you, and uh, just kind of leans in and waits for you to uh, slap him. Lazarin? Oh me, yeah. Oh, it's still me slapping. Oh shit! You're still at the uh, table. <laughs> oh true. Uh, I don't. I, I just assumed Davin would be like tagging in. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, same. Sense. Honestly, uh, we can uh, do that as well. Um, I just assume it's hey, like some weird ramble, but if that's this how it's is, done, then yeah, no, sure. This is, this I'll, I'll, Lazarin can slap everyone. Yeah, that's fine. Cool, it's a massive five. Uh, you completely miss. Sorry, you sorry, four. You completely <laughs> miss to the point where you almost slap the contest lead and he kind of looks at you. All right, I think you might, uh, it might be time for you to tap out. If that is... No. Sure. Yeah, yeah, I've well, just, uh... Lean forward then. I do the same thing I did to last one, like right here. Right. How can I cheat at this? Well, a, a right saving throw. <laughs> a natural twenty for twenty-three. <laughs> I also rolled a natural twenty. What the fuck? Uh, for twenty-four though, but like, okay, we oh, roll, we roll again. Fuck it, we roll again. <laughs> oh god. Two spa. Two. 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 Um, yeah. You get your shit rocked. Oh! You get your fucking shit rocked. And you just, like, fucking look Abby in the eyes and then fall to the ground. Uh, Elasrin is again crying, but this time because his face is on fire. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, like, do a pirouette as well. I do the full, like, 364. <laughs> yeah. And then I'm like, Davian! Ah! <laughs> Alright. Um, man, that looked like it hurt. You alright there, sir? Uh, Don't care. <laughs> alright. Uh, and he I'll just kind of come over and just to... like drag a Lazarin back. To the <laughs> he, then, <laughs> he then points to the other red dragonborn to take your place, essentially. And it's now the elf versus the, the dragonborn. Uh, the dragonborn slaps the absolute shit out of the elf. So now it's currently one person of each team still up. So Davian, you get called to the table and it is you versus this, this, this second uh, red dragonborn. Oh, and I'm you just get for to a way that I might cheat. slap first. What? I said, I'm just looking for a way that I might cheat. Yeah, how do you cheat in slapping someone? <laughs> I don't know. You use magic to. Wait, hold on. Use your magic. Say, hold on. I could probably. But uh, I don't. I don't want. really. I don't really have anything. Uh. As I'm dragging Lazarin away, I'll just put an arm on Devin and Dragons. say, <laughs> you know, fuck him up. Um. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. And I'll give him. I'll, I'll cast en Enhance Ability. Oh, a pog. And give I him could... Bull's Strength. I could have fucking done so You have advantage now. Okay. All right. And this is a, a check. The, yeah, correct? for you, slapping is a strength check, uh, which right. it is now your turn to slap. So, yeah, right. make a strength check. With advantage. With advantage, which is contested by the Dragonborn's Constitution Satan. Oh, my God. I rolled so badly. With advantage, too? Shit. Yeah. Uh, oh, I tried. Four. Yeah, no, however, you, uh, oh, however, however, with my talisman, I can add a d4 to the roll okay. on, of an ability check. Okay. So, can we make this four an eight? We can make it a five. <clears throat> yeah. Um, you slap. And you slap him in the face, and this dragonborn just kind of like looks at you, grinning. And as the the the, the slap impacts, you can see him like not not even flinch, just kind of looking at you, and almost kind of like raising an eyebrow. When like was that? I'm just, I'm just getting warmed up. Right, of course. Just getting warmed up. And he now gets to give you a a walloping. So I need you to make a Constitution saving throw. Uh, 19. He completely misses. Kind of like two of his fingers kind of like scrape your chin. As he just kind of... 
don't, I don't know what happened there. I, uh, mm. And um, losing your nerve. The contest lead is now now looks back to you. All right. Go on then. And the dragonborn is just kind of standing there waiting for the ever living shit to be slapped out of him. On. Eighteen. No, nineteen. Nineteen. He rolled thirteen. So you wind up your slap and just kind of like very sad, like almost hear the just the, the clap just echo kind of through the tavern uh, as this red dragonborn just kind of like you can see his entire face kind of going that way. You can see like one of his teeth kind of kind of just like get slapped loose. You fucking. Basically, I rolled that one on the con save, so you fucking slap the oh, yeah. shit out of him. Uh, Weak chin. And now the elf shows up, and it is now 1v1. This this is winner takes all between you and this this other elven individual. Uh, I would like uh, just to just walk over to Devian, just to have a, a, a like a, still a looky over, just to make sure everything's see he's doing, doing good, you know. Um, uh, it is now. Can I give him anything? No. It is now your no, turn to be slapped. You don't have Maybe. guidance. It won't help her. It's uh straight oh would it yeah it would give him a d4 it would. The console, i'll yeah. give him a pat i'll give him a pat on the back to like my god all right actually no no it won't be on the it won't, it won't be on the save it's no but uh, when i slap on, back when they slap, on the ability check right, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah i'll still be like you've got this <laughs> oh. um my nose hurts my face is okay good. make a con save uh Devin. Come on, baby! Uh, it's good. Uh, 18. Oh, yeah, that's really good. Uh, you get slapped, but, like, barely even fucking flinch. Like, it's almost as if you, you felt the impact, but it was not impressive at all. And the elf kind of looks right. at you and just kind of looks at, looks at his hand and does, like, this, like... <sighs> all right. It's your turn to slap. Fuck him up. Seventeen. Fuck me. All right. Yeah. No. You again. Perfectly. Hit his like full cheek, and like one of your fingers kind of hits the ear a little bit to the point where, as his face gets sent into one direction, he just kind of, in a reflex, with one hand grabs his ear like, Arr! and just kind of topples over onto one knee, uh, and at that point, the the guy hosting just kind of. All right, we have a winner. What's your name, sir? Davian. Davian, good job. And gives you three gold pieces. Ooh. Here's your prize money. <clears throat> right, guys, they're going to 15-minute break. We'll be back shortly. And he goes to the bar and grabs a drink. So while these guys are, 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 are slapping are each other. Are slapping. <laughs> uh, Thel, what did you want to do? So you said there's, like, some bards playing music as well in yes. here, right? Um given i have uh thel has like uh, almost like when you can visibly see like the light bulb going off over their head kind of thing you see you have like a oh idea moment and mm -hmm. uh look at kes and go since this is awake and all you've never been to one let me maybe help ma set the mood a little more traditionally and i'm gonna go over to the stage where the bards are and like whisper in one of the bards ears like hey do you know this song and they're gonna be like yeah and I want to see if I convince oh. the bards to let me do a, a really quick, just like single song performance. And I have a specific song in mind. And if you can, Dutch, I can send you the link. The clip's only like 25 seconds. It's not long, but could you play an audio clip if I make the, if I convince them to let me do the song? Uh, yeah. Do you kind of, do you give them like information on what, kind of, what the vibe kind of is? Or, or... Yeah. Yeah. Um... Make a persuasion check because they do kind of like look at you and like that's not really that's not really, this is not really. Um, before I do that, mm -hmm. let me just check if this does what I think it's going to do. Um, hope so. Hope so. This mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. Checking the wording of a spell for a second. Okay, no, that's not exactly what I want. Okay, I will, before I go up to him, like, as I'm gonna go up and be like, 
hi oh my gosh love you're playing very talented listen i had a request and like kind of put a hand on their mm -hmm. shoulder and i want to cast charm person first while i'm talking to them okay all in not even friends just straight up charm person <clears throat> it's a charisma save correct it's a wisdom save on their wisdom part save. yeah <laughs> okay uh what's your dc 18. Okay. They look at you and just kind of... Because the charm person is one of those things where like, they'll know if the spell fails, do they know that they... If it fails the saving throw, charm until the spell ends, and they know when the spell wears off. It doesn't say they know if they make the save. If they make the save, I think they just don't. Nothing happens. Oh, okay. And if they're charmed, they'll know when the charm effect ends. <clears throat> He'll just kind of, like, look at you. Well, thank you very much. Um, I'm sure you're here to be, like, a lot of others and put in a request. So let's just get it over with, shall we? So is that a yes? I'm I'm confused. The so tone it depends on like what you're going to, to request. Okay. Um, and it's a known, uh, like, farewell nautical song amongst seafarers so if any of them have spent time in like taverns by the sea they would probably know it and i just want them to do the instrumentation i would I be mean, doing the singing Jax is about to get like winter soldiers <laughs> <laughs> make, uh, make a persuasion check. with advantage or not because the charm no. not work charm didn't okay didn't work. just a straight okay persuasion mm -hmm. 18 <laughs> <clears throat> You're right. Um, I suppose we can do that. Fantastic. Kinda... I'll flip him a gold coin as well as a thanks. Looks right. And boys. then here, here, Dutch is the clip to play. Because obviously, on stream, my... but, like, you guys yeah. won't be able to hear. It, but... it won't get caught. It shouldn't get copyrighted because it's super Yo, short. Link. And it's also someone's rewritten the song. And link do you want to just put it in the dungeon chat. select chat? Yeah, yeah we'll link chat. it. So we can and yes, put please. it in the. Yeah, so you all can listen to it too, and this is what she... Like, she would sing the full song. This is a 20-second clip, but she would sing the full version of this song. Pausing Spotify, we're going off the fucking... Thank you, Dutch. Sing. But I can't we're sing for shit. It would playlist. ruin the moment if I did it. Okay, okay, okay. Yo -ho. So, so Yo -ho. Thel begins... Like, Thel begins singing? While they play the instrumentation? That's, yeah, that's the and you here. almost swear while you're listening to it. It starts out just one voice, but it almost swears. I'm like, you hear what sounds almost like there's more of her. It's like lingering, some of her lingering siren magic and siren song. She's not using it to charm anyone in here. It's just the effect, but it almost sounds like she's joined by a chorus of voices, but she is the only one singing at parts of the song. And the TikTok you're gonna play is the person who inspired her voice sounds like in my head when she sings. Light is out for this one, boys. Gabby <laughs> <laughs> um, belches and uses control flame. So. Yeah. <laughs> Jax is like singing along, but just hiccuping like every third word. Yeah. And little magic for clouds. Because yeah. yeah, the I also put the lyrics uh, in the just chat swaying. if you're curious and why they're relevant. So Kess, as this is all kind of, you know, you've been going for about a week. You get told this news, and now this, this, this song, like, how does Kess kind of, like, take this all in? Like, what's going on in her head? She's very much struggling to process. Okay. And, like, every now and then you'll just hear her mutter something to herself along the effects of, like, never see her again. Gone. <laughs> What did you expect was going to happen, Dutch? Like, it's not going to be the happy, happy <laughs> time then, in no. episode, is it? When no, I come but... back and sit down, I'll just give Kess, like, a... Before, I was always, like, the really awkward, like... That was at the perfect time. No. Discord? Hello? Hey. My back? I just got died? Hang on. Was yeah. it I, think every, I think everyone died. Oh, yeah. yeah, did mine that? I was like, I my I feel better now. Me. Free piece of shit. Uh, literally everybody <laughs> died for a sec. Uh, okay. Yeah, it was, hey, instead back. of the weird, inauthentic, like awkward, uh, there, there, thoughts, prayers, shoulder pats I've been giving the group, I'll give Kess a genuine, just like, like, 
touch on the shoulder if she seems uh amenable in like a I do I do genuinely feel sorry like a moment but I won't say anything and then I'll just take my head back and sit down I'm not a total and go back to drinking yeah. <laughs> um Celeste will just kind of look at Kess and like approach um I saw something really cool outside you want to come with for a second yeah okay and she basically leads you outside and kind of like away from everyone and just kind of okay so I lined there's nothing outside but okay. um, <laughs> listen I know that you like me have a you know we, we're not really f- from normal circles and it took me a while to adapt to to that stuff when i got kicked out of my um circle in the ocean I had to well f- first thing i had to do was learn how pirates deal with things and then no longer pirates and i there's a lot of so i could i can understand if maybe there's a couple of things Oh, well, one big thing that you were told today that it's it's hard for you to really grasp. So I just want you to know that that's okay. And I relate. And there's no, you know, no rush. You don't have to kind of go through all of this really fast. You can take your time to kind of figure out what it means and how you deal with it. Mm. So, you know, just don't feel like you have to, I don't know, pretend or anything. Just kind of do it, you know, you do what you always do and, well, maybe not what you always do, but <laughs> just be you. Um, mm. At the end of the day, Dagon was like your best friend, right? And I was... For a reason, right? She liked you being the you we all know, which is a little crazy sometimes. So I'm sure she would understand if it takes you a while to really understand what, you know. That sucks, you know? <laughs> people die mm. and it's why can't people live forever? I don't know. Um, dying is lame. Living is pretty nice sometimes, not all the time. Dying sucks, and ten out of ten eulogy. Dying is lame, and it is really annoying that you have to now kind of learn how to not spend any more time with that person that died, which is also lame. But I'm kind of going off the rails. Um, long story short, we're here for you if you want to talk or need distractions. Um. If this party setting is too much for you, also understood. Um, Just do what you think is right. Without harming anyone. Oh, okay. Important. I figured I'd add that in there just in in case. Yeah, condition Uh, there. mm. Mm -hmm. No, I'm, I'm okay. Like... The first time she died, Mm -hmm. kind of made me remember that these guys don't live super long. Well, some of them might. What's with the, like, what's with the new one? So. She just, well, she is a handful. And very full of herself, it seems. Um, mm. I don't know, something about basically what you are to the air elements and he is to, or oh, Davian is to the Sooth and, 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 and Lazarin to the Earth Plane. She basically is that envoy for the, the water guys. Um, um. And man, she just really likes to talk about how she used to be a siren and kill people for some reason. 
Not true. They always ask me about it, which I know I'm not here, but I have not once. I brought it up when asked. I've never once brought it up unprompted. Just uh, I think that's um <laughs> bullshit. You brought it up pretty early. <laughs> oh. so you won't ask me, what's your backstory? What's your deal? So she gave you the cliff notes. Other than and that, um, I'm sure she's useful <laughs> and like kind of tied to you guys now, given that, you know, she's been put on some mission the same way you guys have. Um, Great. Maybe in time you'll be able to find out that there's more to her than bitch, but um, I mean, she sang that song pretty nice. That was a nice gesture, I guess. <laughs> so maybe there's more to her than just... But she just seems very full of herself. Very yeah. confident. Maybe a little too confident. But then again, I don't know. If you were, cho well, you were. You, know, you were chosen by some kind of, maybe not a god, but some kind of very strong patron. Nepotism. Well, <laughs> you know, I guess that, that, that fills you with some confidence as well, right? Knowing that you've got the backing of, of the, the air elemental plane and how Davian probably feels pretty confident given that he's got the fire plane on his side and so on and so forth. So maybe it's a bit justified, but, yeah. um, you know. Meeting new people sucks, and I'm really bad at it. So maybe you know, don't take everything I say as 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 law. But uh, I'm sure she'll prove useful, and I'm sure with time, she might even turn out to be a friend. I don't know. You guys are stuck with her. Yeah. Now. Hoping still waters run deep. That is, you should use that. Thanks. Okay, well, um, hope you're okay. Wanna get a drink? Yeah, I'm all right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <clears throat> and uh, she kind of just, like, kind of drags you back inside. And this will be roughly when the slappers uh, were done doing the slapping. Uh, hey, ooh. there she is! <laughs> I'm like, uh, Davin, you come over to the table, like, again, because I Celeste. was, like... I won! Um, I'm just like bruised, like red face. Like, <laughs> I'm so I proud won. of you. What did you win? Mm -hmm. Two gold. Three gold. That's it. Well, I had to. You had to pay shit. You had to pay. <laughs> Shut up. Was that worth <laughs> this? And she kind of like gestures to your face. Well, I won three gold and the satisfaction of knowing that I can shit out of a couple of stupid dragonborn and a couple of stupid elves. Yeah, but. Could you slap the shit out of me? I hate that so much. <laughs> you, you, you've you done it in a rainy hour. day. <laughs> yeah, because you're in a, rainy, a cold rainy night and stalk. Yeah, I, 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 give, I give a lesson one of those, like, like, you know, like, on his <laughs> face, like... <laughs> I'll, be, I'll think about it. Okay. Um, drinks? Round on me? Drinks. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes, can I have a pint? But you get you one, wine. you get just one. Yeah, a pint you fill wisely. it with wine. A pint wine filled with wine. wine. <laughs> we call it the mega pint. <laughs> How about a gallon bucket filled with wine? That's a gallon. Can I get one of those, like, one of those bottles that, like, oh, suck moms of wine. have? That's like, it's like a glass. It's like a glass, but it's like the whole wine bottle underneath. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a wine glass. Did you, did you mean what basically this wine glass is that holds That's three quarters of wine? That's a glass, man. Anyone else? It's a, it's a wine anyone glass. Anyone else want anything? Officially. Or it looks like a vase. Want anything special? Or what do you want? It's a wine Surprise glass. Surprise me. I would like a number 68. Okay. Yeah, we'll we'll six don't like it while we don't like Oh, what should they get me a? Uh... I'm tall enough now. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah, why are you so tall? Oh, Magic. One. Magic. Okay, I mean that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, there's Wasn't lots really my of choice. But... Lots of strange face shit in the woods that they went through. Um, there was a lot of. There was Jax a guy who was in love with me. Kess, it was kind of fucking weird. Uh, Jack's Castell. Last time that happened. You guys want one of those like 100 random drinks? Yes. Sure. Um, actually, I don't want it to be hand? random though. I'll I just roll want it. number 69. Uh, I roll. I rolled a random one as well because uh, Alison will try and sneakily go to the bar and order himself a drink. Uh, yeah. It was at number one. I got zero zero one. 
Okay. I got a 52. Oh, We're gonna 52, 53, 54. We're just gonna go I got 63. 63. All right, so we'll look. So. I'm keeping the tab, by the way. So, like, all the drinks I've just written down, and then we'll just... Uh, we'll, we'll I'm just keeping track of how many end. I personally consume. Um, all right. So, we've got... Well, you get your pint of wine, uh, Elijah. Um, <laughs> just a bowl of wine put into a glass. Let's be real. Okay. You, Davian, yeah. get given a poly pilsner. Ooh. Uh... Does it make me enter a romantic relationship with more than one person? No, it'll That's turn you, in, actually. It'll turn you into a canary about halfway through your drink for the next two minutes. <laughs> oh, like polymorph. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. So you just, mm. after finishing mean. half your drink, turn yeah, into a canary? Not, not polyamory. No. Dude. I'm always <laughs> getting those mixed up. That's why I keep fucking sheep. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Celeste oh. gets 38, which is... Motherfucker cube goes to the as the poly. Uh, the drink is served as a hollow ice cube with liquid spirit within. As the ice melts in your mouth, the drink will come out. How exactly does not the drink is produced is well kept secret. Look at that. So it's just this ice cube with drink in it. So and she's kind of she's kind of sucking on the ice cube until it melts and then the liquid comes hmm. out. So that's fire, keeping her actually. busy for like the next five minutes. Dude, I love um, eating ice cubes too. Jack's sixty nine. Oh, dude, 69 know. is the Thoughts and Prayers. You know what this is. <laughs> hey, oh. hey. I don't want people to know my thoughts right now, though. That's uh, a little bit depressing, considering so the you other, had, you know, like, celebration. It's not branded or anything, yet. so you drink, and then, you know, for the next... Uh, you do reverse, <laughs> reverse the deck thought spell, so people that are, like, right next to you will know your surface, surface thoughts for the next few minutes. I'm oh. depressed. You guys <laughs> just let me know when you want to hear them. Cool. I, will, I want to know. <laughs> I also would like to know, but that's later. Why did Lazarus say Dagon come back? Did Dagon come oh. back? Is there a way? Oh, I did say that. Oh, I did say <laughs> that. Just thought, tra thought trails like that. Yeah. You got me down there now. Thanks, Lazarin. Uh, <laughs> Lazarin does know this. Yeah. You get a flaming dragon, a spicy beer that causes the user to breathe fire whenever they burp. Uh, well, I mean, before I go back to the table. Mm -hmm. Downing that drink, okay, <laughs> and I'm just good. coming back with my mega wine. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Bell, yeah, you get belching rum. Make a Constitution save. Oh, okay. There we go. Not, not good. An eight. So as you finish your drink, you immediately just let out this thunderous belch, and everyone in a 100 foot radius. Is deafened for six seconds. Whoa! What the oh, fuck? And as oh. that and as that is done, you hear from out like somewhere in the in the crowd, they made another one. Way! And everyone starts <laughs> clapping. Yeah. And, uh, obviously, this is a drink that multiple people will have had, and this this effect yeah. is is nothing new to the people here. I feel like it just That's happens funny. in the bar like every like twelve minutes or so. Yeah, I much. like <laughs> I like to think there is this moment, a Lazarin like. Just you know when you get like sudden like tinnitus when you're in, like a loud like bar or whatever and then it's just like nothing. It's that he's like, and it's all good. So, Kess, you get a ciderella, which is a sweet yeah. apple cider considered a girl's drink, but even the toughest bloke will begin giggling like a little girl after a few of these. <laughs> so it's just a. Uh, what was it called? It's just a nice ciderella. ciderella. Oh, ciderella. Is there a ginderella? Maybe. <laughs> oh, that's a scroll on my list. I don't get it. <clears throat> oh, baby. What do you mean? You have the list. In proofread them. I'm learning about Control F Jin right now. <laughs> All right, I Control fucking will. F Jin. I fucking will. <laughs> Jinzo. Control F Jin. Control F Jin. That's my favorite. Control F. What is happening? Weird, weird, weird Windows hotkey they added. Okay, there's good more gin on your keyboard. Yeah, yeah. There's good berry gin. There is yep. oh, gin, so like begin also gets cut. That's fine. Oh, <laughs> oh good berry gin. I bet that's fucking fire. There's Hold on. Ginger ale. Hmm? I'm drinking ginger ale right now. And there is oh, uh, nice. goblin spit, whiskey and gin mixed with the barkeep's homemade mints. Oh, I thought you were going to say the barkeep spit, and I was. <laughs> <laughs> I was going there. I was like, oh. And you go, and you dude, go, give me some barkeep. of that good berry gin. What the heck? Uh, um, yeah. Give me that. 55. I'm joking. If you drink enough of it, which is a mild <laughs> healing potion, which may or may not compensate for the damage done to your liver, or you yeah. falling down the stairs while drunk. Um, 
So if when you drink you this, I need to roll one d six for the healing, but also one d four for the for the drunk damage that you take. Okay. <clears throat> so if Brook strikes that with this drunken damage, if you right? one you deal you take <laughs> one point of damage throughout the night of just you know I don't know bumping into people, fucking falling on your ass, whatever. But this uh, good berry gin heals you for four. So just chill. Well, I rolled a four huh. on the d four. Nice. Oh. So that's four damage. But a five on the d six. So yeah, that, there we go. The good berry gin as you rise rain. But I am forked. Uh, so as the night kind of progresses, there are more games for you to play. There are more drinks to be had, uh, but on the, obviously it is a night. It's it's very it's a very mixed night of like yay party, but also friend dead, and there's a lot going I on have, emotionally. I so. have a question. I'll leave it up to you. How, you know, how you much are, through like, my uh, drinking antics of just fucking downing drinks every time I get one? Uh, am I starting to really feel it? Yeah, at this point, everyone has had a few drinks, so uh, everyone roll a constitution save. Three. Three to be specific. The one time I will. Oh, Discord's dead again. Sick, dude. Oh, yeah. Go Discord. Woo! Go Discord. Hey, go Discord. Hey, yeah. go Discord. <laughs> Woo! Hey, go Three Discord. Three pieces of shit. Go Three Discord. Of shit. Hey, oh, right. Hey, guys. What's going on? Sorry. I, no, I, going got, I got a 12. That's a. 28 for me. 28. I got a 21. 21. The one time I wanted to fail, I rolled good. 18. <laughs> 18. Nine. Uh, <laughs> which one was a 12 again? Me. Okay. So Jax, Fell, and Cass, you're you're still pretty fucking good. Like you're you're fine. Oh yeah, baby. For Celestia as well. Celestia is also super fine. Um, Davian, you're not shit faced, but you're definitely beginning. You're, you're entering the slurred you're buzzed, speech you're happy time. Uh, section of being drunk a little bit. And, you know, Discord out again. Let's go. Hey, hey, Discord. Hey, hey, Discord. Piece of shit. Hey, free, hey, free piece of shit. <laughs> free. <laughs> <laughs> what is up with Discord? Today, I, don't know, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, Davian, you're not fucked, but you are getting that, like, you know, slurred speech, not walking very well anymore. Um, Kalazrin? Hello. What did you roll? I rolled a nine. You are fucked, my friend. I'm drunk. Hey. Yes. I'm, do, how much to my mega pint am I? Oh, it's gone. Is that about, gone? About, maybe got like two good sips left of that. Oh, okay. Okay. It's not towards the end of it. That's fine. That's what I need but, to know. Yeah, you are, you are obliterated. I'm friend. blasted, as they say. You <laughs> are at the level you were at Laura's wedding. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, <God. laughs> Go. Uh, we, I'm gonna we be... take him home. <laughs> uh, gotta give him a Snapchat. Oh, yeah, dude, give me, give me on the. Uh, there are some games uh, for you to play. There, there's more drinks to be had. But basically, at this point, I was kind of leave you to you know whatever conversations uh, you want to have while at the party, or things you want to do, and you guys basically just tell me when you're ready to. Uh, so the... Jack's just gonna take a Lazarin kind of aside. Uh, okay, that's fine. <laughs> uh, I'm drunk as fuck. I self wobble. Yeah. I'm like holding on to you. I'm like. I'm gonna. Can I get a glass of water, please? Uh, mm -hmm. What are you drinking water for? <laughs> no, this is for you. Loser! Loser! Water! Loser! I give him a little slap. Just enough to hurt. Oh! Me. <laughs> okay, I, I need what? you lucid for in seconds. You need the bar lucid? Puts, puts a glass of water down. Wait, you need me lucid? I'm just gonna hand it to him. Drink, drink this. It's alcohol. Oh, I probably shouldn't have any more alcohol. Also, you said it was water. <laughs> no, I didn't. Also, oh wait, you need me. Wait, Jack. You say you need me lucid. And I'll touch my. I uh, touched it. Huh? Shut up. No. Uh, I, I, hand, well, I was. Well, just, I uh, well. put a hand on myself, and I'll just cast greater restoration on myself to be fully fucking sober. Nice. <laughs> Oh. I'll spend the hundred gold, the hundred uh, diamond dust for this. Yeah, care. we just got dragon money. We, Damn, we can right. afford that shit. So yeah, you uh, cast well, restoration and you are stone cold. Drunk Lazarin will use the diamond dust. Yeah. Immediately sober Lazarin thinking, I just used so much diamond dust. <laughs> no, no, no. no. I, it would be, I'll be like, I'll do it. So that's just like, I might probably should have done that. Ah, fuck. <laughs> uh, uh, remember, buy diamonds and diamond dust. <laughs> Yes, what do you need, Jack? Hello, one. how's it going? I'm okay. like fully, so, fully sober now. How's it going? Earlier you said that... What a fucking life. Dagon can come back? In theory? But then, no. 
What's the theory? Well, there's very powerful magic. From what I, I don't know fully. I I only know that Daigon's obviously you know Daigon's soul is um not trapped, but it's not past. Um, from what I've heard of what's happened. So um, basically, she's in limbo. Yeah, sort sort of, but also like not. It's like kind of like bad limbo. Um, yeah, the abyss. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah. Um, there is, in theory, a way, but I don't know how. It's using magic that is way above my capabilities and above most people's. But I don't okay. know. Well, who would have access to that? Do you know any very powerful spellcasters? I'm talking well, very we powerful. do know the heroes of exile. They might do, but they have to know someone if we don't. Again, it's. I don't think. I don't, I don't know what has to be cast, I just know it's very powerful magic. I... I don't know if it has to be like some insane, you know, ritual. What's your, what's your or... passive perception, you two? My passive perception? Yeah. Uh, mine's 21. That's pretty good. You hey, kind of like, while having some 17. Kind of just notice that. As Celeste had gone to the bar, she noticed that you two were, and she's slowly been like kind of sidling down the bar closer and closer to kind of like you stop. I look at, I'm gonna just a dead stare at LSD. Get Celeste, as I'm now like fully sober, I'm like, hey. I'll raise, just raise my hand. What's up? You need anything? Well, I couldn't help but overhear your conversation. It's weird because it's quite loud in this. I was really oh, trying. I was really trying. Yeah, I could tell. Um, so, what kind of magic were you I don't insinuating? Know. I don't know. That's There's... the problem. Listen, I'm not saying this is a guaranteed success, but you do have a friend that is related to a genie. Oh, you know the whole story about rub the lamp, get three wishes. Hey, fuck Discord. Hey, yeah, yeah, I was about to say, Discord. I didn't hear anything yeah. happen after you a do. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Jesus Christ. Okay, that was me. Okay. I just changed the region of the channel. Oh, it scared fucking me. Grapefruit. So, oh, hopefully, God. stops. Also, also, thanks. Thanks for me, King. With the, I just heard Dutch's joining sound. Yeah. yeah. Dutch's joining yeah. sound. That was unpleasant. Yeah. I have that turned off, thank you. Grapefruit technique. Uh, well, no. Okay, so rewind. <laughs> Well, you know, you have a friend that's related to a particular species of people whose whole, well, I wouldn't say their whole shtick, but their whole story that kids get told when they grow up is like, you can make wishes come true. So, I'm not saying this is a guaranteed success, but wishes are very powerful and pretty much capable Might. of anything. Might be worth seeing if her family. St Typically, when creatures capable of casting a wish uh, use it, there is a chance that they'll never be able to use it again. So, you know, it is likely possible that none of them have that ability anymore. But it's, it's worth. I don't. Out. As I said, I don't know the the remits of. What spell is needed, or what magic is needed? Again, I don't know if it's a ritual, but if it, a wish, this wish you speak of can do that. Um, wishes can do anything. It's just the well, yes, of we know. Well, we know. We know wishes can do work in theory. Really we know wishes can do anything in theory because that's the whole point of a wish. Like when you make a wish on like your birthday, or like when you see well, like yes, something. It's, it's exactly that. But there is doesn't exactly mean that is like happens. you got to make sure that you word it really well. Because it is, uh, there's a lot of interpretation involved with the actual magic. So if you, for instance, oh, I wish for a million gold. What you expect probably to get is there's, oh, there's just a million gold pieces suddenly in a nice little chest uh, in your in, on your bed or whatever. Uh, in reality, just you get you just this 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 block of gold worth a thousand gold pieces just falls down, crushes you. Same thing. You got a million gold. You know what I mean? So there's a lot of Gotta word them really well, um, but it's you know it's, it's worth seeing if 
Well, any of Kess's relations has that ability. It's very large chance that they don't, but no. It's uh, worth a look, I suppose. But... See, this is only problematic because I kind of pissed off her family. <laughs> Jax, I'll be honest, who haven't you pissed off? <laughs> well, you pissed me not off. Yes. I don't. I don't. I don't mean intentionally. Like you've you you've said some things accidentally that can be misconstrued as being pissing them off. Like the Empress earlier today, for example. I Is mean, I uh, just yeah, many times. Come on, Cecily. That's how would you do that? She did almost kill us. Um, but almost killed him. Well, it would probably would have been us. Well, okay. Anyway, I'll be honest. It's been a lovely conversation for both of you. I had to get shit faced again and um, sure freak some people out. Idea? I don't think anything I've done in the past week has been a fantastic idea, Celestia. I'll be honest. My friend died. My entire like life has been a lie, and here we are. So you know, let's just go, and I leave. <laughs> Celestia just kind of like wide-eyed looks at Jax and just kind of slowly backpedals back to the avenue. <laughs> He's like, I regret tavern, just... so I uh... know. After hearing that, Jax isn't going to drink anymore, and he's just going to kind of keep an eye on Lazarin. I uh just go to the goon like. That screams That's call it. for help to me. I'm just yeah, like, hey, how's it going, guys? What's going on? What are we doing? So let's still like look at Davian and just kind of, um, Davian, you're mm -hmm. not okay. So Lazarin's sober again and is just trying to get shit faced again. Um, he I... seems to not really be in a good place right now. Might I... need his friends. I don't know. It looks like he's about one bad decision away from doing something irreversible. So maybe <laughs> keep an eye on him. I'll go just the thing, and I'll uh, give her a smooch, and I'll saunter over to the bar, and I'll order two more drinks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, naturally. <laughs> Correct. Oh, See, thirty-three. Naturally. Let's go. Number. Number thirteen. 13, for the 33, you get the Necromab. Oh, that sounds totally <laughs> hard. A drink for those who fall unconscious from alcohol. It's a green, green <laughs> glowing liquid, also known as the Corpse Reviver. Man, how fucking apt. Uh, oh, Jesus. <laughs> when poured into somebody passed out from drinking too much, uh, their mouth, they get up, they get up, wake up, but can only walk in ways similar to a zombie for the next seven hours. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Okay, I'll keep that to one side for a later. <laughs> What's the 13? 13? <laughs> 13 is Dragon's Piss. Ooh. A beer that tastes exactly like one would suspect by the name. For sure, not a drink. You need a second one. Yeah. Uh, okay, well, I'm going to... I'm going to get one more. It's like me at the fucking wedding, dude. Oh, really? A really... An extra dirty martini? No, what was it? Yeah, it was it? Yeah, it was. Extra Martini. Yeah, no, I have another. 43. Yeah, this is like, well, just roll it. Juice. Um, 43. A oh, golden goat. Fermented, no, it's a goat! Fermented goat milk and honey. Oh. Where's the alcohol? Fermented goat, goat milk, mate. It's, it's fermented. So yeah. you're telling me. Moldy milk. That I got milk. dragon piss. <laughs> and sour milk. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then uh, a hangover cure. Yeah. Oh, I will carry. All right. I'll Real carry them over to Elazar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Elazar, listen. I'm all this. Do you want the sour milk or the dragon's piss? <laughs> but, uh, I'll take the dragon's piss. Hand of the dragon's piss. I uh, and... take a sip and then just mm -hmm. the... No, 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 you don't. <laughs> oh, no, sorry. <laughs> we do that thing yeah. where we like put arms around. You know, oh, yeah, do that. Uh, yeah. And then and then just throw it back. Not, I, uh... not like that. <laughs> <laughs> we throw it back. The music's popping. Let's fucking go. It's the wedding. I throw my ass in a circle. <laughs> yeah. Throw my ass in a circle. <laughs> I uh I take the drink. We went to the get ball to last like... night. These heroes were just 
shaking that giatch for the 100th anniversary. <laughs> for the, the Rizzler? Ohio. <laughs> Ohio. <laughs> they are so stupid. <laughs> Uh, I will drink it like I'm downing it, and like it's the first bit just goes down straight away, doesn't touch sides. It's the like that second like big mouthful. I'm like, oh. <laughs> wait, Jesus. what are the what are the games right. for them? They're, they're slapping, boy uh, kissing, <laughs> oh, boy kissing. Boy kissing. <laughs> Yo, hang on, whoa, whoa, whoa. what did you do? The bullshit. Pie eating contest. There is wrestle arm. Uh, there's also something called dragon race, which looks interesting. Right. Uh, and as you approach dragon race, it's basically bunch of lizards you have to put money on which oh my god i want in i want in let's so go. bad yeah <laughs> yeah lizard so... gamba let's go lizard gamba, <laughs> gamba, lizard gamba. Lizard gamba. <laughs> yeah all right i'm definitely about to say lizard gamba responsibly <laughs> clearly dragon race how much platinum am i allowed to put on this I could do 500 platinum. Entry, like, oh, the minimum bet is two gold. What's minimum maximum? bet? What's the max bet? There isn't one. Limit does not exist. Okay, 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 okay. If we did. But, like, how many five, lizards are there? 12. Fuck. Should we do some sprinkle bets? <laughs> That's what I was thinking. What's the, what's the payout like? Double same game, um, same game parlays. Uh, the payout. Oh, we all bet it. Hang on. Hang if on. your if us, your lizard out. is first place, you get four times what you put in back. If your lizard is second place, you get third three times what you put in back. If your lizard is third place, you get twice what you put in back. Who's who's put who's betting right now? Who's in? I'm in. Me. Um Is it just is us just, just is it just us three? No, Kessel oh. do it. Is it Damn uh, right, Kessel oh, do it? Oh, I'll huddle the boy the boys are getting huddled in. I'm like, right. If we all bet on three of them, right? We're like guaranteed we're guaranteed to win our money back. We do high bets on three of them each. Let's think about this. How how do Guaranteed. What would we spend? So, okay, if we put 500 gold or 1,000 gold on each, just make math easy. No, 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 Just make math easy. No, 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 we do 1,000 gold total, right, on the three, so 333 gold. Or we just do, like, 300 gold on each. Are you seriously implying that? probably still lose money overall. No, but I'm not putting 1,000 gold down, Jax, because fuck me, that's a lot of money. But aren't you then saying that the organizers of this event have thousands of gold to hand over to us in the event? I don't, hey, it doesn't matter. That's what the that's what the betting says. They're gonna fucking pay out. <laughs> they didn't think about this. They didn't think about rich people coming over here and fucking their betting up. Your breath really stinks that dragon's piss, man. <laughs> oh, <that's so> <laughs> you do like, need a breath mint. A fucking what was the minty one that was on there? I prestigious uh, in his mouth. Gin, it, uh, gin, was it the gin? It, Mixed no. With whiskey. Yeah. There something with, there something with goblin like, spit. Yeah, spit. Yeah, the goblin, goblin spit in it, and then the mint for the. Two goblin spits, my guys. <laughs> <laughs> you get given uh okay <laughs> hold on where is it uh you get given the goblin spit uh whiskey and gin mixed with the barkeep's homemade mints tastes surprisingly good despite its name and as it's as it's tavern tradition a long distance spitting competition occurs after every round so any you just feel compelled to like once you <laughs> drank this thing you can see now that on the bar there is this fucking spittoon well that is designed Specifically for this drink, and you just you just get this okay. urge to. Okay. Uh, so uh, if you will, so uh, if you spit, just make uh, me a. Yeah. Roll a natural twenty, man. Yeah, roll, 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 roll a d twenty. Roll a d twenty. Sorry. Fourteen. I got a fifteen. Fourteen. Oh. Ba -ding, ba -ding. Both of you hit the spittoon. Way. <laughs> I reach over the bar and grab the bell. Ding, ling, 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 ling. Round for everyone, thanks to this gentleman here. Shit. <laughs> Fuck it. Out of the tab. Do uh, the fucking point at uh, Davin, because um, even though I'm sober, it's still the fucked it. Fucked it. Put it on my put it on my tab. I'm one of the heroes of exile. My name's Nicole Sparkwell. <laughs> no, you're fucking not. You're not blue. No. Belly. You're not blue. Dickhead. <laughs> you're not the big blue bully.
Yeah, he's banned from this establishment. Right, anyway, you know? so you guys are trying to swindle the swindler. Uh, okay. yeah, we're, we're going I'm assuming to you're rolling a d12 on this. Swindle the swindler. No, I have not explained any rules yet. Oh. Oh. No, so, so, okay. <clears throat> How much are we all putting down? Oh, I'm, I want to hear the rules first. Hold on. No, 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 no. I'm my money. Y'all can no, no. gamble. No, no, because this depends on how Don't much we're going to do. It's funnier if you hear the rules after, because it's going to ruin yeah. 90% of the things that you're discussing right now. Let's just keep going. Exactly. Exactly. I'm going to bet. So there are 12 lizards. There's 12 lizards? <laughs> Math time. Lizards? <laughs> in the stable? In the, in the stable? The lizard <laughs> in the stable is a literary Bremling. <laughs> <laughs> lizard number three. Okay. Is it three six nine? Lizard number six. <laughs> That's yeah. number nine. Yeah. Yep. Uh, those are the sex numbers. Those are the sex numbers, sure. Uh, I'll take uh, 10, 11, 12. And I will bet 30, 60, and 90 gold, respectively. As you go to do that, the guy stops you and says, oh, I'm afraid you can only bet on one lizard per round. Lizard number three, 333 gold. What? Lizard number six, 500 gold. 500. Lizard number nine. Number nine. A thousand gold. <laughs> One <laughs> million. Anyone else betting? I'm just getting rid of the 500 gold. I'm, I'm, I'm getting rid of the 500 gold. I right cheat. Now. No, just, no. Can it. I take that back? Sorry. Uh, no. Nope. Uh, Bell, what was that? <laughs> Lizard two for five. I don't know how much money I have. Uh, you would have your share I, of the dragon not, money, not as so... Much as these guys uh, sorry, I've just, looked, I've just mm. looked at my money. Can I change my mind real quick? I just make it 862. Mm. Okay. I'm going to write this down. I need a nice... I'm going to mess. So I need, has, oh, no, I've got it. He, has a, he wants a nice round thousand. Someone you know, has to pay this bet. tab at the end of the night. If y'all lose, How much on what lizard? Uh, 862 on number nine. I was asking Duke. Oh, sorry. Sorry, didn't hear that bit. Lizard number three, 333 gold. Lizard, Lizard number three. Three, 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 three. Okay. What about? Uh, number nine, 862. 862. Okay. Soko? Number six, I'm going to do 666. Okay. Sure. Bell, you Jumped said it. two? Yeah. How much so gold? Five. Five gold? Okay. Just five. Is Keska, yeah. is Keska going to just suddenly realize uh, that like, we're uh, fucking Bell, are you betting? Lizard? A lizard? Loser. Elk. 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 Someone's gonna have to pay for our drink tab at the end of the night, and they're about to lose all their money potentially. What do you mean? So, what do you I, got, mean? Like, I got thirty grand. What the hell? We got grand. thirty grand. So see, yeah. All Nothing. twelve of these lizards are being placed on a twelve foot, uh, sorry, thirty foot track. Nice. And you see, there is uh, twelve participants, you four included. Everyone picked one lizard. Um, and the way it works is you go in turns, make animal handling checks, and based on your role is how far they move per round. That's <laughs> fine. Oh my I god, this is the best day of my so life. <laughs> Am I allowed to uh -huh. quickly cast borrowed knowledge on myself? Sure. <laughs> to give um, myself uh, proficiency oh. with animal handling. I, I, we just found the infinite money glitch. <laughs> okay. Dutch, so, that loud? lizard number one. Old. The Dutch. first round. Um, huh? Am I, am I, am I allowed to yep. cast borrowed knowledge on myself? Yeah, yeah. Cool, perfect. So, lizard number one. I cast enhanced ability on myself. Uh, roll the natural 20. So, that first lizard on his first move walks five feet. Lizard number two, which is Kess. Make an animal handling check. Yeah. Okay. Natural 20. Nice! Oh, also moves five she's feet. She's cheating already and she's back for what uh, roll? Lizard number three. <laughs> 16. Uh, yours also moves five feet. Uh, lizard number four. Ooh. Lizard number four only moves... <laughs> lizard number four moves five feet backwards. So, oh, number four is on the minus runway. five feet. Uh, <laughs> it's clawing up the wall, just like. Uh, lizard number five is none of you. Lizard number five also moves up five feet. Lizard number six. Jax, right? Um, yep. 
So I just rolled two natural 20s. Five feet. Oh my god. Huge. Because I have advantage, but like... Um, I like how natural 20 is only five feet. And yeah, like it's just, it's just also five feet. certain number. No, I know. I just, I can't believe I rolled two. That's... Hey, that's that 21st not, one. That I, gotta, I, gotta, I, gotta, I gotta, gotta go gamble real quick. I'll be back. Uh, that's one number seven. Does not I gotta move. Gamble. Number eight. Does not move. So they just stand still. Uh, number nine is a Lazarin. Oh, that's mine. Uh, that's a 30. That is nice. Five feet as well. Uh, and then 10, 11, 12. Five feet. One goes backwards, and the other also goes five feet. So five minus five. All right, so that's the first round. Let's see, I'll just roll for the ones that aren't three, six, nine, or two. I'm just going to get that out of the way. Number one goes back five feet, so he's back on zero. Uh, number two moves. Does not move. Still on five. Number three, I'll wait. Four moves. Does not move at all, so he's still on five. Number five, move. Seven, eight. Doesn't move. Five feet, five feet, five feet. Seven is still zero. Eight's on five. Ten is on ten. Who's on Eleven first? went from minus, Who's from on minus first? five to zero. Twelve. What's on second? What's on second? Move. All right, so now it's your guys' turn. So for number three. Number three, Duke. For some reason you said number three, I just got that scene from Shrek in my head when he's picking pick number three, my lord. And they're all telling him which which <laughs> number three, my lord. <laughs> um natural twenty for a total of thirty-three. Yo, nice. so Yo. number. Yours also moves five feet. So yours is on ten feet ten, total. Ten. Ten feet? Moves ten feet. Oh it doesn't. <laughs> okay. Moves back ten feet because he's being a little shit. Uh, Smiley face. Uh, uh, not terrible. 17. Okay, you also move five feet. It's gonna be a dead heat, man. Uh, oh my god. Maybe two tiebreaker. Be rollies for tiebreaker. Quiver win. A uh, dirty 20. Mm -hmm. uh, quiver? Roll the 30 again. <laughs> All right. There's another Plus round. 42. I don't need to gamble, but I could help you guys cheat. I could talk to the lizards and make the lizards throw. We could fix the oh race. Oh my god, I could talk to the lizards. Oh my god, I we could kill all. I could kill all the other lizards. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's crazy. a little bit obvious. It lets me cast spiritual weapon. Oh <laughs> just, uh, I just cast spirit. <laughs> 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 <You're fake. laughs> <laughs> Uh, Duke, storm. Just for the third round, what would you like to do? Besides rolling your uh, animal handling check. 31. Uh, Quiver? Uh, uh, 22. Uh, uh Soko? So, question. Were we told that we weren't allowed to cheat? I mean, it's, you probably weren't told, but it's implied. Yeah, exactly. Because it wouldn't, if you were allowed to do it, wouldn't be cheating. So. Do I gamble 666 gold for the chance to win? Oh, you have. Why gambling? You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna go for it. Um. I'm gonna cast. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have a thing for this, and I haven't been able to use it in for at all. I don't think. Where is it? Hold. Oh. Oh. So, I picked up Meta Magic Adept as a feat. Okay. A while back, and I'm going to cast. Subtle spell. 
Mm -hmm. Or I'm gonna use the subtle spell feature. Yeah. Yep. Oh my Cast God. uh vortex warp on my lizard. What? And put him ten feet above everybody else. Ahead of, not Just above. a little bit. And won't they see him warp? Vortex warp is like the what you could cast haste and you pick vortex warp. Yeah. Like, you see him like poo poo and like obviously he just teleports forward and like and, well I don't have haste prepared today. So Well that's so, your fault. So you cast Vortex Warp and as the, yep. the lizard just kind of like teleports, the everyone kind of looks and the guy running the game looks at you, looks at the rest. I don't know what these lizards ate this morning, but uh, they've been doing that all day. All right, let's keep it going. <laughs> doesn't give a fuck. Oh, cool. Doesn't give a fuck about cheating. Um, right. God. Kes? Perfect. Wait, so I can send him to the end? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like how we're now no, we're all looking at how we can we're cheat. We're all instantly look. I mean, motherfucker. Do I just do it to him? <laughs> I opened up the barrel, boys. Oh my god. How? The Jax's lizard is okay. currently. <laughs> I am oh. gonna cast Mislead. <laughs> don't you don't mind. Don't be that person. Oh no, just god. on yourself. Mislead yourself. Yeah, mislead yourself. Wait, yeah, that's on. what I'm doing. I'm misleading on myself. Okay. She's just gonna pick up her fucking lizard. <laughs> I'm gonna go and I'm gonna like <laughs> kind of drag the list ahead while I'm invisible and just have like <laughs> the other one of me like cheering on the list. <laughs> and dragged forward. <laughs> <laughs> There's a. He's just, he's just, he's just, this, just like this looking panicked. Just. <laughs> <laughs> you see, like, its head or tail, whether you're grabbing to drag it, it's clearly being dragged. And he just sees, like. <laughs> 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 oh, Kiss. Um, you win. <laughs> <laughs> no, so wait, yours... did, did you did you, did you put it all the way to the end? You just dragged it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? So it doesn't even bet that much. Yours, you is, bitch. yours is first place. You get four times your five your, gold. You get twenty gold back. Yes. The race for second and third doing? is still very much going, guys. Oh. Uh, Duke. Let's go. <laughs> Wait, is next the list. I'm here for it. Twenty-four. Oh, he's not cheating. He's not cheating. Oh no. Uh, so yours I feel is like such an asshole now. At twenty feet, I'm gonna so ten feet away from. Uh... I'm gonna cast. Uh, hold on. Speak with animal. Okay. <laughs> um, and I'm gonna yell at number six. I'm gonna go. Number six. I got some some fresh meat in my <laughs> pocket. Just for you, delicious, tasty, the, the, the best you'll have eaten in a week. Why weeks. are you going against me? I'm, and I will, I'll, I'll, and I'll, I promise you your freedom <laughs> if you come here <laughs> instead of <laughs> running to the finish line. I'm gonna cast fucking. Make a persuasion check. Make, 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 yeah, yeah, make a persuasion check. Oh, grab you. <laughs> I'm gonna lightning bolt your oh. lizard. <laughs> oh, my God. oh, 27. <laughs> Jax, you watch your lizard suddenly 180 and just beeline it straight to Davian. Okay, so I am cat. Okay. No, 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 no. Uh, I'm next though. Oh, it is your next. You're, you are next. No, 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 you vortex warped. Fuck you. Hang on. No, yeah, that's, that's true. That's true. That's, that's true. That's true. That was a turn order before. No, that, was my, that was my that bad. That was my bad. No, that wasn't. Fuck you. This is this turn order. So Elazarin gets to go first. Anyway, I'm gonna cast sleep. Counterspell. Don't you dare do it on mine. On counterspell. I'm fucking all of them. Spelling counterspell. <laughs> you know no, what level I'm, I'm counterspelling you. Stop rolling dice, you fucking bitch. You don't know what level I'm casting it at, it doesn't motherfucker. Matter. Don't give yes, a fuck. Does. Yes, it does. If I upcasting it, okay, like yeah, I but am. he can still roll. Dumbass. Then I'll roll. All right, then roll. All right. 
<laughs> Fuck you, Koima. <laughs> Fuck you. So do I do I add anything to a counter spell? Yeah. Uh, it's your. So it's, I think it's, it's just your spellcasting modifier. Yeah. Yeah. Do your charisma modifier. You have to be at fourteen. Seventeen. Okay. So yeah, it doesn't happen. Fuck, fuck you. you. All right. I'm now it's my like, turn. Guys, I'm I just wanted like, to add some fun gambling, and I'm turning the party against each other. I'm so I, sorry. See, I like like me, there Davian, and next to the cheering. I see. I, I see. I see Davian like. He casts a spell because like, I like can... Snape. It's like Snape in the yeah. fucking yeah. stands during <laughs> the Quidditch. And, and then and then I'm like, this motherfucker's casting a spell. So I start casting a spell, and he kind of spells me. I just look at him. I'm like, <laughs> what the hell? It's like when was it Kess counterspelled someone getting healed once? Yeah, yeah. She did it to me. Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> little did you know, motherfuckers? All right. Also, uh, can I can I still roll my, for my animal? Can I still roll for my animal? Oh, yeah, yeah, of course, I'm about to teleport your fucking bitch out the window. Why did I have a goal? Uh, 17. What was that noise? I don't fucking do anything. So moves up another five. So you're, you're 10 feet away from, from winning. You are now at a tied first place with uh, Davian's... Uh, or tied second place, I guess. Full with, second. Uh, with Davian's uh, lizard. Bitches, <laughs> I subtle gold. spell, cast Vortex Warp again, and that shit's going to the finish line. I don't give a fuck. Okay. So your lizard suddenly is out on the uh, finish fuck line. Y'all, you got second place. Damn, got... you just snatched his freedom from him. That's fucked yeah, up. I did. So you get three <laughs> times your money back. So what's three times six six six? One thousand eight hundred, and then no, it's one thousand nine hundred something. Yeah, yeah, I was I was doing the maths in it. One hundred eighteen. Nineteen ninety eight. One hundred eighty. Shit! Shit! Nineteen ninety eight. Woo! So Shit, obviously, woo. you know, like you remove the six 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 from your from your stash and then just add nineteen ninety eight. Yeah, that's what I did. Make it easy. Woo! All right, so this, the race for third base is still up. You <laughs> two. Uh, I know this is gonna be like out of turn order, but can I just fucking grab Davian's hands? <laughs> Davian like saddles up, like you saddled up next to Davian, just kind of. <laughs> like, and I just look at him like, you motherfucker. What the hell? <laughs> you could cast a spell, but I can't. That's fucked, dude. What the hell? Oh, to speak with animals isn't really a. Like yeah, but a you know what? I was going to fucking cast though, did you? I could be cast this into help both of us. Yeah, but after watching Jack's fucking. Come on. Also, Kess is 1 1, so Kess definitely did some bullshit. <laughs> I, I don't no know. Look, it looked it looked fine to me. Just went really just, fast. You see that mother? It looks like getting fucking dragged. <laughs> like, it's clearly but Kesha was still right there cheering. I don't know. Did you not? Would considering I can cast mislead. <laughs> what I know. We'll say you do have strong suspicions, but no evidence. That's the same. Sh Wouldn't that's you have to investigate the illusion to do that, sir? I have a passive perception of 21 and a passive inside 26. That's what I'm, so saying, like, that's what I'm saying. Like, because you know the spell, you have strong suspicions, mm. but like, no proof. And I'm like, no. David, this, that bitch definitely used mislead like this. And I cast mislead. <laughs> okay. Davin just stands there talking to the illusion. <laughs> yeah, and and I'll, Don't know I'll, drag, about, mate. Uh, I'll drag mine and Davian's together and make it like a photo finish. <laughs> well... <laughs> Looks like we've got a tie for third place. Isn't that interesting? What do we do in this situation? Do we go again? Uh, or is just gonna we should have them fight for it. Fight to the death? Cheat. You mean the lizards or the, the players? I won. <laughs> no, no, no. What we'll do is the following. You both photo finished. We'll flip a gold piece, heads or tails. Wait, on, what if we make them foot race? Hold on. What if we just agree? Make them foot race. Shut up. What if we just agree? Me and Lazarin get our money back in full. Leave it at that. No, no, no. We, we came third. I will love. Uh... Like just taking wherever the mislead is and just like fully just being there, it drops on back. No, no, just no. Like... <laughs> yeah. no, no. Uh, we definitely should be. Uh, you know, we're Stop. promised an increase in our prize money, so you know. Right. So, it goes. so that's what I'm saying. Heads or tails. One of you gets it, the other one doesn't. 
I feel like. Which is what I'm saying. Hey, you know, they're fully finished though, you know. We both so... get our money back. Well, yeah, we both get our money finish. back. Yes, we both get money back, but we both also get like maybe. What was well, originally what we would have got if we won, if we came third? Sorry, what's the original? Is it? it just double. I would have got six hundred and sixty-six. No, no, so it's just double we've got. So why not we just yeah. get like plus half, you know, like a point two, you know, like a point one point five, you know? Make a persuasion check. Oh, that's, I don't win those. No persuasion. Mm -hmm. oh, I actually do win those. What the fuck? Uh, twenty-one. We make a compelling argument, money bags, man. <laughs> That's me. That's what they call me, Mr. Mm -hmm. Moneybags Man. Mm -hmm. That's the one. I can hear the jingle of your pockets from when you were around the corner of the, the street. It's a lot of people in here uh, will have heard. They call them jingle pockets. Uh, wrong. Wrong. I left most of my stuff at home. <laughs> I mean, you still had like 862 gold on you, bro. Yeah, I mean, like, I, I still have like a thousand gold, and like, you know, that's not the point. Right. <laughs> anyway, uh, so I guess it's just all marbles in your pockets then, wrinkling around. Whatever. Um, uh, what I'll do, if you were to agree, instead of giving you both double what you put in back, we split it. So, since you're both tied. I am allowed. To, I'm legally ob objected to present one double. So if I give your friend his money back plus half, you your money back plus half. That together makes one double. I legally did what I had to do. You both walk away with some extra cash. Perfect. Music to my ears. All right. So, Times Davian, 1. you 5. get. 333 times 1.5. I get 1,293 gold. There you go. That's going to be fun to organize. <laughs> You're fucking... So, 100... I mean, gets 500? 862... Because it's 49.9.5? Oh, wait, I guess you get 499 gold and 5 silver? Yeah, we do silver pieces around these, these yeah. parts, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So... That's what uh, threw me off. So there you go. That way, I mean, you all walked away with some money, so... <laughs> Got really chaotic. Uh, and we'll I say no one that... else cheated. That's crazy. You know, for sake of our break. break time as well, um, you guys, this is more you want to do at this event. Uh, um, I mean, the only thing I'd want to do quick is just go up to Kess and just be like, I know what you did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. I know That's what you point. did. I, we'll say that, I, know what, um, I, I know what happened here. <laughs> Kess is you... like crouched beside the lizard, invisibly petting it. <laughs> oh yeah! To I, just, I go to the I go to the I'm like, I know what you did, and I put my hand on the shoulder. It goes through. I'm like, fucking do it. <laughs> See, cast the invisibility, find actual curse. Put my hand on the shoulder. Go. I know what you did. <laughs> this is just there on the floor, like with her feet up in the air, like on her, like laying on her chest with her feet like up, just fucking kicking in the air while petting the fucking lizard and suddenly laughing. Like, just a hand on the shoulder. I know what happened here. I don't know. <laughs> All right, we'll say uh, we're yeah, gonna take a break here, a quick, uh, quick five minutes uh, break, and then yeah, we'll, we'll yeah. go back to it. You are, shall we break. say that you kind of all all gather for the the trek back home, trek to bed, or is there? A yes, more, sir. Uh, well, we'll, we'll do that. I think we might have some RP stuff, but yeah. But um, you know, we'll, we'll pick up from as you guys are kind of leaving this area, this establishment, and then heading home. So yeah, we'll be right back, gamers. God, this is chaotic. Holy fuck, dude! Night out with the with the, with the gang. My God, I can gang see, back, gang back. I can see their whole brain. That's crazy. I can see oh my, and there's nothing there. Crazy. <laughs>
other than that. <laughs> oh, never mind. What did you I found what I have against eyes. Uh, funny. Ooh. It's funny. Whoever has something that he thinks, like he thinks he's funny. No, but... no, I know I'm not funny, but I find me funny, and that's all that matters. Okay. Making other people laugh is just a secondary bonus. If I make myself. Is that laugh, an affirmation that your therapist gave you? Damn. Thanks for that, Marlo. Cheers. Hit, hit me straight. Hit me straight in the live one. Got him. <laughs> all right. Yeah, we're screaming again now. Thanks, <laughs> Mal. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> All right. Anyway, um, so <laughs> by the way, Laura, for the Halloween huh. one shot, real quick. Yeah. Yes. How upset would you be? I played. I'm, I'm basically I playing Shaggy. Not upset at all. In fact, if you all somehow secretly, totally not intentionally I'll play plan to make a ranger like, with Scooby an animal gang, that is a then... dog, and the ranger just has the munchies all. I'm down to. I mean, do it. I mean, you could all plan to do some sort of theme because, like, um, I believe Ecto's character is uh, given Ecto's interests and channeling is heavily inspired by <laughs> Ghostbusters. So yeah, you could all pick like some iconic Halloween season oh, yeah, adjacent dude, character. What was if I D version of them? What was if I didn't do a Halloween event like one, but it was that's fine. It's You've already still, made yours, yeah. it was still it's still film adjacent though. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Play what you want. It'd just be funny. So, uh, by the way, Someone I did the horror. mathin uh, on the tab. Uh, yeah. You owe 19 gold and two silver. Wait, is that including yeah. the first round that I got? Yeah. I, paid for, like, the... I already took that gold out of my own. Oh, okay. Uh, 16 gold and two silver. There you go. Most I of that will... is the round that you bought for the tavern, but you know. Uh, I mean, that was like yeah. 100 drinks, but given that that's, those were all eels, they're only like a silver apiece. Not even that. Crazy. Ten gold. Ten gold. Yeah. Oh yeah. Um, uh. So I'll figure out. Yeah. Who's, I cough that up. That is the the the, the check. I'll the I'll do the sixteen gold. All right. Someone else do the fucking silver because I don't work in silver. Well, since I'm I got five silver, silver from my race winnings, I'll throw get rid of that five silver. It has has literally been canonically Dutch this entire campaign. Alashan does not work in silver or bronze. <laughs> well no one works in bronze. Copper maybe. It's when? Copper, sorry. Same shit. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry. Um right. So you all uh get ready to to leave and as you're outside, uh it is pretty fucking late. Like we're at like two, three in the morning. Kind of is what we're what we're talking. Uh, where are you guys headed for sleep? Are you guys going to the, the, the Golden Blades or the Tears yeah. of Exile uh, Guild Hall? Ooh. Where, where, we'll where are you gold. sleeping tonight? Tears we'll of Exile feels gold. more like home. Oh, I'm going to be like, yeah. oh, about that. I kind of maybe took over your room. I kind of room. redecorated it a little bit, but I was told that you have your own space anyway and you don't really use your room so that it would be fine. Yeah. Should, should probably be in Brooks's room anyway, so... If you're that. I mean, it was either that or use your friend's room, and that seemed a bit disrespectful even for me, so... Is this the place where uh, Brooks painted that mural? Or is that somewhere else? That's like... Uh, not. That's, I think, was actually our, our place no, back that, in Overwatch. That's like your yeah, actual house. Yeah. Back oh, in okay. That's our actual yeah. house. And like, yeah. Yeah. We're basically uh, in our campaign one character's old rooms in the yeah, Heroes of Exiles guild hall. <laughs> Sick. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so Heroes of Exile it is then? Yeah. Okay. As you arrive at the guild hall, naturally, it is very quiet. Um, most of the people are asleep. You, as you go upstairs uh, to go to your rooms, you do see light coming from underneath um <clears throat> nicole's room um indicating that there's someone there i knock as you knock you kind of hear just this like <laughs> and some like shuffling and as the door opens uh you can see ryagel opening up um <clears throat> oh sorry yeah um, uh. man. i was 
kind of using Nicole's room as a bit of a planning room, and I think I fell asleep. Um, how was your night? Good to see you're all still... Well, that's a bad way of saying things, so I'm going to unsay it before I even say it. Um, you seem to have had a fun night, given your recent... I got filled in by the Empress. I know everything that happened, and very sorry. For, you know, I'm gonna be honest. Where I go, I've not cried for a good like hour and a half, two hours. So like, that's good. Let's, let's not start this again. You know, let's not. Right. Because I feel just, it coming. It's you, happening. Could you it's say happening right Rydell, now. Shut the fuck up. That is fine. That's a bit rude, though. I'm gonna fuck. Right, go shut the fuck up. <laughs> Noted. All right. Um, I'm gonna go home. Um. Yeah, I, I, just making plans for whenever you're ready to discuss what comes next. Um, either way, it's not good. Um, but we'll talk about that when you're ready. So, hey, have a great night. Get some sleep. And um, I'll be around for the next couple of days. Whenever you're ready to discuss the immediate next steps, let me know. Um... This is awkward now. I'm gonna leave. Bye. She just Bye. Leave it us. Fucks off. Uh, not even like like the, the 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 candle that was lit on the desk still on door still open. Like she's just like okay, I need to get out now. <laughs> Davian fucking whistles. Oh no. Uh, dog. Bird. Oh no. Dog or bird. <laughs> dog. 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 <laughs> Fucking comes barging through the hallway um, and kind of like breaks and then and, and sits right before you. Go sit in front of the fire and drink a little bit more alcohol. And any of you are invited to join me. I'm going to go to bed. I'll join no, you. I'll join. Nightcap sounds entertaining. I'm not really tired yet, either. I'm beat, but uh, I'll take one more drink before we go to bed. I'll drink. I don't even need... I don't sleep, so... Come on, Legend. No, I'm... I, uh, it's Come on, boy. Get, no. Come on, Legend. I'm... Davin, considering how you're speaking Come to on, me boy. now, I'm definitely not going... <laughs> oh, I'm need to... I'm just going to sleep, so... one more drink, right? I can do plenty more drinks, son. No, you fucking can't. I've got the alcohol, if you want. You guys make me seem like I uh, have an affinity for drinking. Um, oh, I did watch did you like put one? two wines into each other today. So that nah, wasn't me. And one looked really nah, yeah. spent entire that was very called Dragon Piss. Nah, that wasn't me. I don't know what you talking about. That didn't happen. Uh, anyway, so I I'm know, just going to I know you and I can like, joke about making a rosé like that, but like I didn't actually think you would ever do it. <laughs> That's why I was no. Grief takes many forms. I've known you for a, little, a long time now, Elazar, and you never struck me as a coward, but I guess here we are. <gasps> oh, yes, because using words and taunting like that always works. I'm going to go to bed. It's worth a shot. Uh, and I will just go into whatever the fucking room it is. I'm pretty sure I may have gone into Cole's room. <laughs> Feeling yeah, I did yeah. that, but I could be wrong. Whatever room it is that all my shit is in, I am going to close the door. If there's a lock, I'm going to lock it. And I'm just going to sit and look at the green mask for a few hours. Yeah. Just stare at it. Right. And that's my night. Okay. So the rest of you, little Blame. nightcap, downstairs at the fireplace. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll pull out our um, bag. Bye. Oh, just about 30 bottles of um, thoughts and prayers. Uh. Yeah, we still have all of those, don't we? Yep. We do. Fun. So, I know we brought it up before. Um, but... Even, I don't want to turn this evening into a depressing one, but it is something that I've been... kind of been meaning to ask. So where are you going next, you think? Like, what's... what... you know... Where where and when? For me, the when doesn't really matter. For the where, I prefer Swamp Dragon next. Yeah. 
Oh, great, a swamp. Yeah. Aren't you, glad, aren't you glad you made it back just in time? You don't miss the swamp. Ugh. It's so excited. At least I can fly. It's fine. As for um, when, I mean, obviously sooner rather than later, but I suppose it depends how long it takes for everyone to pull themselves out of the mud a little bit. Lazarin, right? Hmm. Okay. Is he fit and like emotionally capable of hanging out? Of course again? not. But everyone gets okay with time. Yeah, but the thing is, right, you guys hear me out. Lost someone very recently to something similar that you're about to do again. I'm just worried that if his head is not in it, not only he can die, given that he's kind of the person that, well, kind of keeps you alive. Um, might be a good idea to make sure he's up and ready for. Because mm. he does not seem it right now. Well, you make a good point. Let's, to be clear, I mean, we're all hurting yeah. at the loss of Diagon. Elazarin also has to grapple with Valor's treachery and, mm? you know, Valor being the bad guy and all that. Oh, did you guys forget to tell her that part? No, we definitely did throw that in there. I remember that being said. I mean, it, out of character was said in Dutch's recap. Like, like I don't know if we told recap, Kess. Kess yeah. Oh. I'll, I'll give Kess the little <laughs> exposition of the whole trip. No, TLDR, shit. Lazarin has been gaslit and manipulated for his entire life by the same guy his that entire life killed by Lied to. <laughs> yeah. And, and that... No, no biggie, really. I feel like that that was like the, the, the sort of the thing that really seems to be hitting him hard. I, well, it's, it's a combination of the two, I guess, but we can't really afford to wait. And as much as he might be struggling, I still I still think, you know, he's he's not a liability. He might not be his best, but... It's not that I don't, you know. Obviously, it's not my fight. You guys do what you need to do. I would just prefer to have you all come back victorious and alive. Um, but... Obviously, you know Elijah better than I do. When our backs are against the wall, there's no one in the material plane better at what we need Lazarin to do than him. Okay. No matter what his state. Well, we could take some extra time here. I, I, I do have some things I'd like to craft. If we can't afford the time, then, you know, it is what it is. It's just, you know, like, obviously I'm not trying to tell you what to do, but given that well, you know, you came back proving that none of you are immortal. Um, I want to make yes. sure that you, well, sure. You ensure that you're at your best when you next head out. And I just, without trying to be an asshole, Lazarin kind of seems far from being his best right now, you know? Yeah. But... Uh, on the subject of being mortal, guess. Yeah. You I'm not. Are... I'm not like immortal, but like uh, no, I you're not. Uh, you guys. No, no. <laughs> He's back, baby. Let's go. <sighs> I, can I can help you. Waffle Meister herself. Hmm. I mean, I probably already have, like, between the, the difference between Feywild time and Material time and only coming back to the festivals every year. I mean, also, I'm 
I, I know I don't look it, but I'm up there with Big Blue in years, personally. So, you don't. Anywho, do either your dad or granddad still grant wishes? Well, I know my dad granted a wish for Sai and turned him into a Ganassi. I don't know if Ow. he has any left, though. Uh, oh. It's kind of complicated. Does, does he leave, like, a certain amount in his lifetime and that, that's all he can grant, or...? <laughs> what do I know about this touch? <laughs> Basically, you know that um, they, the jinn, especially the jinn, the jinns, so, like, the air elemental type, have an innate ability to, to grant wishes. Uh, but you do know that it takes an immense amount of power, and they basically need to be at their strongest when casting it. Even then, whenever they cast this, the wish spell, there is a decent chance that that will be the last wish spell they'll ever be able to cast. Because there's just a bit, there's a pretty decent chance that um, the power that they draw from inside of their being that is capable of granting wishes just depletes. Um, so you're not sure whether he still has one in him. Uh, it's possible. You don't know. Um, I don't think he's, like, run out. I think... Well, I mean, at the moment, he's really sick, so I don't think he could do it anyway. And I'm pretty sure my grandfather's out because Blue's been around for fucking eons. Is there any other beings that can grant wishes? Um... I'm sure there are other djinn, but I don't know them personally. Right. I'll have to think on that one then. You think for Daigon? Well, yes. Lazarin mentioned that that could work. And, you know, obviously we'd have to be very specific about it. And, it know. seems like a, a dangerous notion to be sort of grappling with at the moment. I think it's the perfect notion to hold on to. I feel like maybe closure would be more important than... And false hope can be more damaging than betrayal or death ever could be. Also, but what's the point of having it, funerals and wakes not... if you're then going to bring them back anyway? What's the point of a remembrance well, We haven't ceremony? had a funeral or a wake yet, technically. Tonight was the wake, allegedly. Oh, well, tonight could also no, just be a celebration of friends. You can always celebrate someone's life, though. I mean, dead or alive. <clears throat> I mean, like, uh, <laughs> if you'd prefer, I'd drop it. Then no. uh, I just, I just think that chasing after the potential resurrection of Diagon is a slippery slope to, you know, potentially false hope or I don't know, getting us sidetracked. How, who knows how long it could take, you know? I'm not saying it has to be a pressing thing, but sure. exactly. something to be mindful about. It's something that we can be mindful about when what we need to do is done. And it'll be very different from the first time you tried it. Resurrecting her. She was, she was a ghost. Clearly she died once. Oh, Just um, the second time. Yes. Yeah. Man. Um, you guys have been through some shit, huh? Uh, Just a little bit. Kidnapping? Death? Oh, just in the last week. <laughs> <laughs> I don't 
think I'd be able to do half of this shit you've done. You just kind of, you just, just kind of keep on trucking. How? How? How does this not? Well, I would ask how does this not destroy you, but then the last room, right? It definitely does. Just not in the way it would. Oh, it destroys you physically as well. Well, yes, but I'm just saying. Maybe there is some truth to this. prophecies, right? Because look at you, all of you. Any sane individual would have cut ties and ran. You haven't. It's not really a choice, is it? Well, there's, there's, always ties also wrong. there's always a choice. There's always a choice. Absolutely. If we cut ties and run, everyone dies. Mm -hmm. I'm not up with you, though. Like, knowing that, that is what that state. That's why we're still here. The other problem at this point is if we did cut and run, Dagon died for nothing. I mean, look, it's where we point. sit. Someone did it before us. They did, yeah. I don't know. I, I, I don't put much store in the prophecy. Red, just they've... It was pretty much in similar scale as what you guys are doing. And they didn't cut ties and run. As the group are talking, can I very sheepishly walk in? Okay. It's like, I couldn't sleep, I had a bad dream. <laughs> I mean, no. <laughs> I it's... This is yeah, like, this is where the yeah, night I'm turned just, into I'm this doing, like, I'm doing, I'm doing the... <laughs> this is like the part that, you know, you go out drinking with your mates and you come home and you're like, oh, one more, you yeah, party, and then you sit down and this becomes like, you guys are having like the deepest fucking drunken conversations yeah, it, ever. It, it also, it becomes a point where I'm like, I'm upstairs and I'm like, I'm doing my fucking looking at the Mars screen goblin looking thing, right? <laughs> I'm just staring at the mask. He's full green goblin, yeah. Yeah, no, no, no. I'm like staring at this mask and then like I just like it'd be like 10, 15 minutes or whatever pass and oh. then I'll, oh I think what am I doing? I need to be with my mates. Like mm -hmm. and I don't know, I'll, I'll, I'll... You be with the whole Here's Valor yeah. talking back to him. As as Celestia yeah, like sees just, you walk in, she just so goes, it. Speak of the devil. Oh, that's what I feared. No, so, we were just talking about like that. everyone, really, just like all of oh, you. We're all form. the devil. Oh, okay. And angle. Huh? <laughs> your angle or your devil? Uh, devil. <laughs> just your usual I'm... late night drunken ramblings about fate, destiny, and the power of choice or the illusion of choice, depending on. Oh, your look. I like the illusion of choice. Yeah, what's having? What's having? What's having choice? I had that for a, a while. Yeah, I just heard about that. Oh. Yeah, sorry. The whole dying thing. Yeah, it's been great. It's, it's a lot of all ones. It's been just a fantastic week. But you know. Mm. We're more so I... Well. Oh, Phil and Kess in about Valor. You know, I know. I, I gathered. But mm. I feel like there's nothing. With... Check on my... That's fine. Yeah, we'll continue just now peeing. Oh, fuck you. Uh, <laughs> uh, He's going to miss it. We. Hey, wait, take it. You deep. know, when it comes, pull out your Oscar level yeah. performances right now. Yeah, yeah. When it, when it comes to Valor, those memories are not tarnished. They still happened. Valor was still a very important father figure to me, better than my own father. He was just dead for a lot longer than I thought he was. Jesus. So, but the times I had with him. And the lessons I learned are still true. They're still real. I'm not saying he hasn't questioned. I haven't questioned my entire life and my entire being and everything that's happened to this point and the fact that everything I have done or will do is predetermined. You know, we have seen the prophecy. I have been... You know, tried to be recruited into and manipulated into the night webs you know my father sold me away and then now expects me to cure him and to let bygones be bygones or at least grumba does it's a lot let grumbas be grumbas <laughs> but it all still happened and i'm just 
I, if we're being open and honest about everything, I still feel guilty of Daigon's fate. Not what happened with Brixoth, but before it was my revivify that went wrong. Uh, Maybe it's if my I was... fault. I got sent to a plane somewhere. Yes, but I'm the one who cast the spell to try and revive her, and suddenly she's back as a ghost. If I was better at it, I could have done more. I should have done more. I should have been better. We were fighting one of the Dark Eight. <laughs> I think you did what you could. You can't live with your past. Didn't have much My wife to used to on. say that you can't, you can't make your past make you who you are. You are what you make of your past. Why is Look at it this we may not be able to change everything, but we could change some things. You you can't really I don't know. You, you can't lament the fact that there's seemingly no choice and everything appears to be predetermined and our destinies are already on the wall and whatever and simultaneously feel like you should have done something different or better. What's from I mean, the, from that's the, the funny hypocrisy. It, from the tidbits I was told, wasn't she potentially happier in that form anyway? I mean, she was. I, heard, I heard she couldn't speak and then she could. I heard she, she wasn't a fan shut up. of, she did of seem her original intense. forms. That's true. She was happy to let her old body. It's rot. still the frailty of which her soul now lives weighs heavy. Everyone's souls are frail oh, and fragile so things. Just, just for my, because she's dead, right? But you said more than that. Well, yes, that's what, I'm, that's, sure. what I'm, that's what I'm getting to. But like, you mentioned that. Her soul is just kind of in a place now, and it's not really the afterlife, but something else? It's more, it's... Imagine, like, the worst place you could go. And imagine it ten times worse. Her but soul is trapped to say somewhere. Is, if it's not the afterlife, but a physical place... Another plane of existence. That mean is possible, theoretically, to go and retrieve it. No idea. I d I'll be honest, I don't know how souls work. Is There's that a connection. topic worth looking into? It's definitely worth looking into. Because but... I'm pretty much done with all the prep for the Astral Sea stuff, we're, we're basically just kind of waiting for the logistics side, but 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 there's not much more research to be done there. The gifts are a bit uppity. Um, and boring, apparently. Very boring. <laughs> uh, Thinking of... The one, the one guy did. that does speak common, all he knows how to ask is... Blah, blah, blah. Where are the toilets? When? <laughs> when are we going? Blah, blah, blah. Uh, the crash, blah oh, blah yeah, blah. Yeah. It's it's, it's biblioteca. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really mm. annoying. Um, <laughs> and I told him a thousand times. Oh, listen, man, we know where to go now, and we know how to get there. It's just a matter of getting ready, getting the supplies, getting the people hired, getting the, the, the airship ready. Long trip. There's dragons in that area. It's not quite safe. All right. And... So let's see. Sorry, let's sorry, see. sorry, 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 sorry. Anyway. Um, if, in our absence, you'd like to undertake a little bit of a research project yes. on how to retrieve a damned soul from the abyss... Yes, it was where I was... By all means. Uh, have you guys discussed what's next, or am I jumping the gun here? Swamp Dragon. I voted for Swamp Dragon. Right, that makes... I'm getting very, very sense. tired of the heat and the dry, personally. Makes lots of sense, I mean, I thought... I don't know how Kess feels about that. I don't know if we have to deal with Pale Cutter is going to be um 
the utmost importance. Obviously, with your father's uh, life on the line. Yeah, Kess, obviously it's... you know that the, tr the air elemental troops are like actively fighting. Uh, basically doing the, the, the groundwork of, of making their way close to the lair of, of Pillcutter to kind of give you guys a way in. That, that war is being fought actively. As far as your dad goes, like, he's definitely doing worse. Like, it is, it's this very steady decline. Um, so, but, but like, you don't know. So this could last for another few months. He could last for another few years. Could be a few days. Like, it's very hard to tell. But you can definitely, you definitely know that, like, over the week or so that you've been with him, every couple days, you just kind of notice little more green blotches and patches kind of appearing. There's definitely signs of decline there. Um, I mean, things are getting worse, but the, the path to the lair is still being fought, so I think we might be able to do the, the swamp first. Okay, the second it becomes known, if on our way to the swamp we have to go, I'm sure all of us would, we would turn heel and, you know, about turn and go towards Pale Cutter. If um, things get much worse for your father, whilst on the way. Mm. Um, when are we planning on going? Can we have a few days? I have some things I'd like to do over the next couple of days. Um... If it's okay with you guys, do you mind if I go do them? You're welcome mm. to come with. I need. I would like to try and find where my family are hiding, as I tell them to, and speak with them in person. I, I suppose, despite my difficult relationship with my father, I probably should cure him of his ailment, considering I have the way to. <laughs> It's the merciful thing to do. Mm. I've had it for I'll a little you. while. I should um go see my family, make sure they're okay. I haven't checked in for a while. Be good to see them. I can watch you kill your dad and then I'll kill mine. That's the hope. I don't know if it's a complete cure all, if it's just going to be a uh, Stopping of the degenerative process and the beginning of a regenerative one, but um, if you don't mind, that is the I would like to do that. But no one, um, if it's if it can, if you we have to go now, we have to go. I don't want to. A lot is riding on us. Mm. I don't want to delay when delay is not needed. I mean, as as far as I'm concerned, they think it's an old man, but I should probably do something nice to him, for him. I'll take your silence as a as a yes, but uh... yeah, I don't really get a say. <clears throat> I mean, you do get. Let's say everyone gets a say. I mean, you may not be going on to kill the dragons with us, but. Whilst we're still here, if there's stuff you would like us to be doing for you, or want to be spending time with us, you would more can do. Out with you. I do prefer Sorry, I'm not the... sober you. I... You mean how I am now? It's fantastic. I didn't mean it like that. I'm just saying <laughs> you're a little edge when you're drinking. <laughs> and he slaps like a bitch. I turn around and I slap Daphne in the face. Strength check, constitution saving throw. Let's go, baby. Slapping contest rules are back. <laughs> uh, it's a 13. Oh, well, I rolled a 14 on the die. You I rolled a 14. Like, you definitely so, so slap I rolled, him, a, four, but, I rolled uh, a 14 on the die. Minus one. <laughs> you definitely like... And it, but but you can, it's, a, it's that thing where like only really half your hand connects and it doesn't really do anything. Um, yeah, no, I wasn't, that wasn't very impressive. And, and, I mean, you just proved that you would need slap like a bitch, you know? 
Mm. Um, I was going against the champion to be first, you know. Hold on. Oh, here we go. What? Um... <laughs> hold on. No, no, hold on. Uh, Onu, <clears throat> Onu is gonna <laughs> tackle um, Elazarin. I'm gonna kill your dog. Whoa! I guess it'd be a, like. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it'd be like a shove Damn. attack. Yeah. So mm -hmm. Onu's strength against his strength athletics. and dexterity. Oh, athletics, acrobatics, right? Oh, Onu, not one. Oh no! Onu like goes to jump no. against Lazarus, but like, kind of like halfway. It was like, oh, he just misses. Nothing's kind of nice. It's like this, like jump up, goes from a very <laughs> no. I like to think, from, like, I think he jumps goes from, goes from like a attack to like a please pet me, and like the yeah, dog he, instincts he, he, he like, jumps, like, over he, for a second. He, he jumps up. I assume he's doing a jump up, like he's just doing like the jump to like you know when you go like that, yeah. like a dog like jumps yeah, up yeah, there, yeah. and I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, this pause into a little like. like even though this is like the, this, uh, this, this primordial was... spirit, sometimes yeah, the, the, the instincts of the body he, he inhabits kind of take over. Yo, he's got like, that dog in him. He, he do got the dog oh. in him a little bit. It yeah, was like, gonna be a shove a from prone and then lick his face. Yeah, I know, but it's but it turns, way, it turns, you know, it, a good outcome, I, I guess. I see him jump up and I'm just like grab his paws and just like you know do a little. <laughs> <laughs> After like a few seconds of that. He just kind of realizes what he's doing and he's kind of. Scritch, scritch. <laughs> 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 like, realizes that, you know. It's a... Even dogs don't want to be near me. Like... Stop. <laughs> <laughs> do you, do you know where your family is, Lazarin? Um, I can check in, I suppose. I can find out. I think I know a rough idea. Um,. And I'll, I will cast uh, sending uh, to my mother, and just be like, and just just be like, hey mom, what's up? No, uh, I will. I will <laughs> say, eh, it's like doing a text. Hey mom, yo, where you at? <laughs> no, I'll, I'll just say, I am a Lazarus. Um, w, uh, w Y A. Yeah, where you at? <laughs> yeah. No, I'll um. W U. Sorry, uh, I'll just say um. Hello, Mom. Too. Uh, sorry for no communication. It's been a lot. Uh, where are you? I need to see you and Father. This is 2 a.m. by the way, so I'm waking the fuck up. <laughs> Good morning. God, this really takes, is me drunk. It takes it's me few, calling my parents. A few, you in real life. A few minutes. Would you do it get a reply? Good morning, and. We fled the kingdoms as requested. Currently in the Empire. Up north. How many words was that? That's Fuck. pretty much there. I think you got like yeah. four, if that. Up. Oh, hold on. Up north. Let me see if I can describe this place in four words or less. Here we go. Oh, God. Maybe a fucking name of the place would be a good start. <laughs> Relax. Chief. Sorry. Sorry. Chief. Sorry. 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 <laughs> getting the map out. Relax. He's whipping his map out. He's... <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's great because I'm gonna next use another third level spell to be like, yo, what the fuck do you mean? <laughs> Classic parents like, oh, I'm at the shop. Which shop? <laughs> what do you mean you're at soup? I'm at soup. <laughs> at soup. <laughs> I'm outside. The soup store. They are in. No. Oh. Um. Colino in Thermoga. <laughs> On a little ski break, ski ski vacation, mate. Anyway, we'll get ski Okay. Can you just uh, write down that place for me and like 
DS chat or something, just so I fucking remember Ooh. it, because how's it spelled? Just Imagine so it's spelled. player asking DM to take notes for him. No, I'm asking how it's spelled, basically. <laughs> As you say it. Oh, is it? Okay. Yeah, but no, my no, my stupid ass. I'll spell it wrong. <laughs> yeah. Which uh is too much. Mm -hmm. East, like basically east. Almost towards the mountains that separate Thermogar from the the, the next uh, province over. Um, oh, okay. South so of, of, of Dorbadir, which is like the big ass capital city of that area. Hmm. So, mm, no, not a big city, but not a small little town either. It's like a a, a good a good town, like a yeah, big town, respectable, respectable. That's some small town shit, bro. Okay. <clears throat> but yeah, um, with that said, you do know that uh, the Empire, compared to the the new land, the Empire is very traversable via teleportation circles, airships, whatever the fuck. So uh, pretty easy to get from uh, one place to another. No, that's cool. Uh, like... We haven't gotten that far into the settlement of the new land just yet. Yeah. But uh, the Empire no, that's... does have that. <laughs> easy, easy. Yeah, exactly. No, that's that's cool. That's cool. Well, they're in Thermogar. So, that's good. They're not in Thermogar. As I say that, I'm going to look at my fucking uh, thing. <laughs> the uh, spying thing. <laughs> See if I've got any things left on it. <laughs> uh, you still have one on them. One, 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 one that hasn't been. Do I get the feeling that this is quite a recent? Uh... Like I check, I I think Alasman probably checks it pretty regularly, especially um, at the night. What I'll that, say like... is that you do notice that when you're inside the Heroes of Exile Guild Hall, significantly oh, less charges get used. Um, so you think there, there's a good possibility that they've lined this entire we'll motherfucker with lead. Yeah. So that it's yeah. in, in, in penetrable I also time. like the fact that there's, oh, like, yeah, some. I just like the fact that there's someone out there. And I know it's, like, probably going to be some god power, right? But I just like the fact that there's, like, there's some temp somewhere whose entire job is just to, like, keep on scrying on us until they finally get a hit. There's, like, a big, like, control room of people. <laughs> there's some, there's summer interns. We got one! We See finally we got, got one! We did it! That's did it. done! <laughs> yeah, the literally, government this... actually found somebody <laughs> we're looking for! Literally the Simpsons movie, like, you know, that... <laughs> <laughs> it's that massive control people scrying on each of us just be like come on one of these days <laughs> they've, got, they've, they've gotten you a couple times there's nothing real yeah i know but you know, they get us and it's like oh fuck they just killed that dragon shit it <laughs> <laughs> motherfuckers cool though i mean fucking tiamat was there herself or so you think exactly exactly and she's there like what the hell <laughs> <laughs> but um Anywho. So Leslie will just kind of get up and say, it's, it's, it's bedtime. And she'll kind of like... Who's the cow Okay. Not. Sorry. I want myself didn't mean it. Sorry. to that. Sorry, Sassy. I didn't mean it. I'm very sorry. All I'll say is that one person here that needed magical help to sober up again. If you hadn't have done that, you would have been super fun. Which is, in my opinion, a bitch move. Good night. I never, like, I never said I wasn't a bitch. <laughs> You've literally seen me cry for the past, like, three hours. <laughs> <laughs> we love a man who's self-aware. <laughs> Oh, I, I know I'm not in the, um, 
best state of mind. Mm. Is there anything else? Anything else we need to discuss? Or, um, do you know? Because I feel like I've said quite a lot. And How are you guys all doing? Because it's... I've not checked in with you, and I probably should check in. It is... I've been quite self-serving. Right. Do you know, okay? Doing Resists right. the urge for a snarky answer, knowing obviously this is not directed at me, but I hold it in. I I will still, like, when I'm looking <laughs> around the room, I will still look at Thel to, like, answer. Like, I'll still, like, just because you're in the room, right? <laughs> Thank you. I'm still, well, I mean, I haven't been in touch with my folks in a while, but... Oh, God, yeah, how are they doing? I don't know. I haven't been in touch with them in a while. Have we, we've never met Devian's parents, have we? No. No, cool. Then I I can't send to them. Um, I mean, we could always try and put... I could, I could scry on them. We could, yeah, could try and... Do you have anything of theirs? We could try and see how they're doing. Oh, God, I don't know. Are you are you <laughs> hap, Are you also happier in the knowledge of not knowing? Is it the, the case of no news is good news? Uh... Well, I mean, I don't think Briar's Town would exactly be a target for dragon attacks. But if that's the case, then they're probably looking after a lot of victims of dragon attacks. So, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm sure. I'm sure they're all right. I'm sure they're more worried about me than I'm about them. I mean, I'm... Oh, I don't know if news of the ragtag fuckwits has made it to their doorstep, but well, if it has, who knows if the members of the ragtag fuckwits have made it to their doorstep? Just well, I mean, you know, the handsome, tall ranger that killed a vampire. Oh, I was gonna say, thank God you said ranger because you just said handsome tall. That could still be Jax. <clears throat> I'm... Is Brooks tall? Yeah. I can't remember how tall he is. Brooks is kind of tall. Two inches I know, tall like a Lazarus. Oh, yeah. oh no, a Lazarus is exactly average height. So, <laughs> average height counts. <laughs> Hands. The more I think about it, the more I should probably try and at least send them a letter or something. Because. If I do end up dying to one of these dragons, it'd be pretty shitty. You, by the way, if you die to one of these dragons, I mean, I'd better have died first because I, God, <laughs> handle that. That goes for all of you, by the way. It's not a competition. I never said it was. I mean, like I said, I'm gonna outlive all of you all by like so long. <laughs> yeah, because if if we run into trouble, you're gonna fuck off again. Yeah, it's true. You do have that tendency. Uh, okay. I did it to... once. So if you do. Let my parents know that I'm dead. Okay. And then, uh, you know, when the world is inevitably taken over by dragons and you leave to the plane of air, we'll be all right. For don't talk to my you. parents or my family, Kess, I'll be honest. They're going through some shit. They don't need that. I think they'll be happy. Yeah, to I mean, they have you for a son. That's burden enough as it is. They, no they gave me away. I've talked to in my life, so. They gave me away for a reason, Damon, didn't they? <laughs> <laughs> crying. Yeah, Couldn't stand the crying. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> when you're a child, it's a little more expected, though, you know? Yeah. Like, Well, it's true. Well, I sold him to the church in the first place. Well, that's what I'm saying. I didn't even get good money for it in the end, it turns out. I've got more money now than they sold me for. And that oh, we've got more money now than empires. <laughs> Like shitty empires exist, Jax. Small empires, but yeah, empires. shitty ones. They're not really an empire, then. I mean, I mean, it could be a small bit. If you or if you owned a whole island, would you class that as an empire or like an you know? I would island? say it's more of a city state. A si one <laughs> island is a city state. That's insane. <laughs> like if it's multiple. Well, a city state is smaller than an empire. Right, but it's also smaller than like just a country. If it has an emperor. <laughs> There is this island called the UK that's a country, and it's smaller. Uh, pretty sure it's, it's a monarchy, like not an empire. Five countries. I'm pretty sure and... there's actually a state in a different country that's way Stop! bigger. Stop! That's crazy. <laughs> Cease! And Dutch just like, no. Dutch 
As the Being room the begins to shake the and more cracks appear in the wall, <laughs> playing a what very dangerous game. It's so weird, because I see one, two, three, but this fourth wall looks very, very... <laughs> very That's why it's all, it has all cracks. <laughs> that was made of paper. Shambles. <laughs> One drinking episode, by the way, to end the campaign. It's happened one. It's happened two in a row. <laughs> Let's can you go again. on people a lot? What did you say? Did, can I? Scry I have yeah. the ability to. Yes, I do not have the um, objects I need. What's you happened? need. Uh, you guys have one of those, right? No, no. We have we have the like literal item of like a scrying eye. Yeah. We do not have the a thousand gold crystal. I think ball. it's a scrying orb, and that thing would be worth more than a thousand gold. Uh, again, can I use uh, one? I don't have prepared. Two, I I don't own a, a crystal ball to look through to scry. No, no, Why do you ask, Kest? Don't you have an item that lets you just scry for free? I literally once do. Yes, yeah. You do. That, that, yeah. That's what we're saying. Okay. But Kest just asked me directly. Can I right, scry? Sorry, sorry. Yes, in theory. Uh, I scry with my little eye something beginning with B. A bitch, you. <laughs> Bellend, you. Fuck. <laughs> I, I do the, uh, not not to inside joke Metscape, but I do the fair enough shake with a uh, death. <laughs> fair enough, mate. Dude, that wall fair is enough, just breaking up. Break it, it's breaking up. Um, Very fabric. Uh, like, for a, anyway, for a split but... second, you look at that wall, Elazarin, and you see a guy yeah. with headphones on and dark hair. Staring back at you. Staring back at you. Staring back at you. You're the reason I'm fucked! <laughs> the abyss stares back! Like, fuck! No, uh, to continue the conversation, uh, well, I think I can in theory, why Kess? I was just curious on what my mum's doing. I'm not sure how long it will have been for her since From I From my knowledge of I'll just like hand cast the scrying eye. Do you know if your mum's on this plane of existence? Or is she in the Feywild? I'd assume the Feywild. I have a feeling I scrying... The Feywild, yeah. Not work. I have a feeling... Scrying doesn't tend to work over planes, or at least it's very much on the same plane of existence difficulty. as you. Yep, yeah, never mind. Really, yeah, scrying doesn't oh, particularly work on different planes. Now, if we went to the Feywild, we could try. She may have come over here, but if we were ever find ourselves in the Feywild, I mean, it sounds like a fun trip, but we're done with the dragons anyway. I've never been. We've to go. been. Have we been to the Feywild in this campaign? Did we do a little we've like woods with space? Yeah, Whispering Woods. Oh, is yeah. oh, okay. That's You're probably one thing because because we've been because we've been to the Whispering Roots twice, right? And yeah. like, because yeah. my brain is like, well, we've been to the Hells, we've been to like the Whispering Roots, we've been to Barovia. I've been to all the chippies. I'll go good everyone. Um, no, I mean, if we went there, we could. How about see? It might be worth having a look now. We can just see maybe she's on the material playing, but I think we'd have to go to the Feywild. I can yeah. maybe see if there's a. <sighs> Again, it would be quite the detour to go to the Feywild, scry, come back, and also, like, are you just wanting to check up on her, or...? Yeah, just, like... Yeah, just to see. I don't want to go home yet. <laughs> but that's not a good idea. <laughs> I was going to say, if all your stories are true and not bullshit, like I think they probably are, um... Uh, Ted, you've not yeah, you've not heard any of Kess's stories. <laughs> you've not heard them. Um, I'm looking forward to it personally. I wouldn't. Um, <laughs> then probably not a great idea for you to go back, anyways. I think, aren't you? It's like imagine being banned from an entire like plane of existence. I'm not. I'm not banned. I wasn't kicked out. Technically, I'm banned from this plane of existence. Okay, sure, whatever. But you can still be like banned after you've gone. They're like, we don't want this. You can't come back. Like, you know? No, it was pretty, like... They like me there. No, no, they like me there. They like me there? And they're like, <laughs> you mother... <laughs> they, they light all these torches for me and raise these nice forks up in the air and say, <laughs> yeah, and start cheering. Um... And they say, we want Kess. We want, want Kess. Kess. <laughs> <laughs> Bring me Kess! Bring her here! Bring her here! Bring her here! Oh, that's yeah. funny. That's such- God, that'd be such- And then they light a big like... bonfire for like, me! <laughs> they, they have all these statues of me made out of different materials that they light on fire, and it looks beautiful. <laughs> that's such a Kess story, by the way. <laughs> like, that's such a, it's such a Kess, like... <sighs> really they, made, they made these piñatas out of- They had candy in them. I mean... <laughs> 
No, um, I mean, yes, we could... that reminds me. Um, I think you'll want this, and I'll uh, hand her Dagon's journal. Oh. And a knife. Hmm. I'll flip to the last entry. God. Ironically, the last entry is titled Forecasts slash New Names. And at the top of the page before any writing, there's a pressed and dried moon blossom flower from the Whispering Woods. And underneath it, says since kes is still with her dad right now i thought i would pick one of these for her as something to remind her of home i'm still not sure if she has completely fond memories of her time in the feywild most likely it's a mix but she tells enough fun stories from growing up there i'm sure it's not all bad hopefully she likes the reminder of home and if she wants she can keep it in her vessel or maybe we can find an artisan to preserve some petals and resin and make a charm to go on her necklace she always wears can't wait to tell her about all the weird little creatures and strange things that have happened to us in this forest. For once, I might have some stories as eccentric as hers, all for myself. While we've been here, and now that we've learned about the prophecy, I had a few more ideas of potential group names. Not that I don't love the ragtag fuckwits and find the idea of the world being saved by them hilarious. But just in case you ever want to be a little more serious, or maybe need to impress someone in the meantime, I have a few more I should bring to the group at some point. P.S. slash note to self, when we have some downtime, I should plan a party like the ones we threw back home that I always watched from the sidelines. It'd be a fun way to thank the group for helping me find my purpose. I wasn't sure why I came back, but I think I know the answer now. Plus, a Lazarin really looks like he could use some stress relief, and I owe Jax a lot considering how often he has to help me repair my new body. I really should be more careful with that thing. It's just hard when I'm always torn between preserving it or myself or using my new abilities in this second chance form to keep them safe. I'll figure out the proper balance enough soon enough. And then the list of names is guard either guardians of the elements, protectors of the elements, elemental enforcers, elemental vanguard, lots of combinations of things involving elements and like protectors or guardians synonym kind of things. I can send the list. It's also on World Anvil. But yeah, so that's the last does, thing that was written. Does Kes read this out loud or just to herself? Just, just to myself. Well, perfect. That's, thank God for that, because that is <laughs> ultimate. Oh, I was going to cry. I mean, Jax has read it too, but fuck, man. I also genuinely wrote it before Daigon died. So, like, I it know. wasn't even writing it, intending it to be, like, Damn. unfortunately ironic last words. Like, it's also, it's, it's, it's also, confirmed. Laura writes the script. It's also, like, it, does. it is so much. fitting for, like, Daigon <laughs> dying, saying, like, hey, Elijah's pretty stressed. Like, <laughs> he seems like he needs some TLC. <laughs> Yeah, He's I put a spa the day. names from the journal in the group chat, if anyone wants to look. Yeah, the Ninja's I Chosen is pretty fucking like cool. Yaks. Um... And don't lose the flower. It's fragile. <laughs> <laughs> Destroys the flower, cries. Also great that you were talking about the Feywild and then Jax gave you this right now. <laughs> yeah. Um... Kes will just like close close the book so that the flower stays like safely between the pages. Um. Hmm. Bell will just like loudly slurp her drink in the awkward silence <laughs> while Kes is reading. I told you about the creatures in the Fair Wild they make by like burying hearts, right? I mean... Laura, Laura remembers. I do. I'll be. <laughs> I'll be honest, Kess, you've said a lot of shit about the Feywild, so, like, be probably? But also, like, whether or not I thought it's true or not, why? Well, that being said, we did establish that Dagon's, like, physical body is still very much... Oh, yeah, in, in your vessel, oh. which she dubs. <laughs> yes. well, that, the physical body of Dagon is still there. You're gonna have to deal with that real soon. <laughs> God, Kiss can go to sleep. It's just gonna be fucking there, dude. I've been thinking about this this whole time. 
awkward. I like to think, like, there is no remembrance also, of this for any of us. Since until it's, it's only like... been a week, the gentle repose would only have, like, very recently ended. So it's, it's still, like, like, it's not gross yet, but it's, yeah. it'll, it'll get there. I it's getting also, there. Like, She's getting bloated. It's, <laughs> it's, it's, it's that, like, also sudden remembrance of, you know when you go to bed and you just wake up and you're like, oh, fuck. Grab a brush, put on a little makeup. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> Uh, you just like it's the bad way, like oh shit, and it's far too late for whatever the fuck you're remembering now. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, dude, oh. the classic for me is like putting a can of coke in the freezer. Like, yeah. oh, I'll, I'll make it cold quicker. <laughs> Two hours later, oh fuck. fuck. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, the physical body is still present. Well, her spirit is gone, but her stench remains. Uh, well, I was just yeah. thinking, like, because of stuff like that, um, in the fair world, we never buried our dead. Like, in the rare cases that someone died. Um, do. Excuse me. Burn them. Oh. Why? In case they came back, do people come back from the dead a lot in the fair world? Not to, I mean, they don't really, they, they don't come back. It, it, mm, well, you know, their body is unpleasant. It's sure. not good. Sure. Um, From my understanding of the Fey world, which is limited, would say that some creature will be inhabit the body or some shit like that. I feel like it would be horrific that if, well, I heard the Fey world, this is not a, no offense, guys, it is not a nice place. Mm. Looks wonders around you. Yeah. Yeah. Like looks <laughs> like looks look looks very pretty, but in reality when you like, you know, scratch the surface, it's horrific. That's my like understanding. How dare you? I think like all of us. No, I'm great. Have you met you? Because <laughs> you have your moments, have you? <laughs> I have my moments. Just one long moment for Kesto, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it's a Feywild moment, and they last longer mm. than um, material play. Yeah. And that's a <laughs> Feywild moment. <laughs> I thought I really thought you were about to hit us with like that's just a theory. <laughs> <laughs> a Feywild. Theory. Um, but with uh, all of this said, <laughs> gapping. Moves on into the night. Rude. Point where you basically come to the conclusion that there is definitely some loose ends you need to tie up or finish up before you venture off. You all, or you know, some of you will have some individual stuff that they want to do um, before you deem yourselves ready to have that meeting of, okay, we're definitely going after this next dragon now. Which, um,. Is to know from you, kind of prepare for <laughs> next session. Um, well, you have a break because next session yeah, is exactly, Halloween exactly. one shot, so, so you I got, got time. You know, now that Kess like dropped the idea of oh, I'm gonna also, have to, like, start working on that. And <coughs> wants to now, we're sit now we're all sitting on fucking heaps of gold, yep, and planning for dragon stuff. We should do shopping off. Off stream, right? I like, like Can you know. Do, yeah, I mean, I gave hey, you guys, I gave you guys a I've list got... of things available. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um, let me know what you guys want to buy, and we'll sort that out. Um, I'll run. Sorry, Dutch to intro. Are uh, like potions pretty? Obviously, like we'll still ask you, like potion wise, like what is available? Is that like? Check, do you want us just to ask you what potions like? When it comes to healing, healing potions, potions and, like... and like your basic potions of whatever kind of resistance are very much yeah. there in abundance. Okay, like there's, a, there's a couple of weird ones. Specialty yeah. potions is kind of like a ask me and I'll let you know whether or not. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll send you a little. I've got a couple there. Um, other than that, also, it's items, other right, campaigns, so I've got some. <laughs> right. Um, you know, there's obviously Dagon's physical body. Um, mm. There's definitely a few things tackle before you guys yeah. are ready to like properly go ahead so with that said shall we say you guys i know because i know soka asked if we could end a little early because yeah it's fine with me um yeah, so 
Shelby said that you guys head to bed after a night of drinking and going to bed and just a lot of good conversation. We'll pick this up as you awaken in the morning with a little Ooh. grocery list of two things to do and that dropping potentially. Oh my god! Potentially. Sorry, uh, that was my medication alone. Oh, all good. Potentially, you know, checking in on, on Laszlo's parents, figuring out what to do with Daigon's body. If Guess wants to go peep, be a peep and Tom, uh, try and see uh, what her mom is up to. She can try that. But yeah, there's plenty of things you guys seemingly can want to do, or at least want to touch upon before heading mm -hmm. off. Um, you have time to do. You were basically told, hey man, take a few days to kind of unwind, relax, you deserve it. Yeah. And then you have time. You have, you have at least a few days to kind of do whatever the fuck it is you want. What is this downtime you speak of? Yeah. <laughs> I do not tell you. Rare, rare commodity. Guess is back. Um, back again. Has Ooh, to deal with the death of her best friend. Um, oh yeah, talking about which. Uh, for tonight, um, Katz goes in her vessel, vessel, um, mm -hmm. and meditates while holding Dagon's hand. Oh. <laughs> Sad. Never tell us that. That's okay. Weeping, <laughs> weeping. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll end it here. We'll pick it up the next morning. If you guys want to do shopping, um, I'll, I'll reshare the list of items available in group chat. Their cost. Um, Bell, for you, this is going to look like outlandish amounts of money. But uh, the party did just find a dragon horde. So they are rich. Like that. Yeah. I they think I wrote down they're what sitting on like, y'all got to your They're sitting on like 150,000 gold or something, something stupid. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I think they got like about 20 no. something K each. We got 12K gold and 10K platinum. Yeah, so 22,000 gold each. No, yeah, I'm super group. poor, dude. So, you know, times five. Because Brooks was also. Uh, Brooks, I think Brooks got a split, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, they found like a dragon horde worth over 100,000 gold. So, they have a lot of money. <laughs> Brooks did not get a fucking split, by the way. No, because he wasn't fucking oh. there for the fight. Yep. Oh, he can go fuck himself. Split. It was me. It was it was the three boys, and then uh, fell, oh, and that yeah. was it. There because those are the motherfuckers who were there. The rest can go fuck themselves. Okay, no need to yell. <laughs> Relax. I'm down. But if you need money, we have some in Kinshasa. Yeah, there is money. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, um, I mean, so some of us shopping wise, sure. figure that out off cam. You have two weeks to think about it. Uh, if there's anything yep. not on the list that you're like, just DM me, and I'll let you know, yes or no. That will yeah, be. We'll, play, we'll end this here. I have 200, Bell, good to have you back. Uh, and we'll be here Yay. next week for the Halloween one shot for charity. All the good jazz. Yes. Uh, Laura, can well, you do me a favor? Be, but... And it's like tonight, later tonight, just like write up a proper like little thing that I can put in the Discord. Like a, a pinned little announcement thing. Yes. Um, Hold on. There's something on the D&D Beyond campaign that I made for it. I can probably send um, you right now as yeah, well. Yeah, cool. And then we'll set that up. But then next week we'll be here with a little Halloween ting. Uh, raise some money for charity, take a little break from regular campaign while still playing D&D. Uh, I was just having some playing Shaggy. Fuck yeah, let's go. Uh, <laughs> I'm and, playing uh, a Bonny boy. We'll catch you then. This, you this, this VOD will be on the YouTube within the next few days, depending on how busy work is. Uh, might be able to do it tomorrow, might be able to not do it until Friday. It's all I got to draw, baby. Um, <clears throat> yeah, thanks for watching. Bell, good to have you back. Hope you no, enjoyed. No. It's rude. It's okay. It's, it's really okay to have Bell back. It's great. You guys are so it's like it's fucking annoying. You all miss me. You me, 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 so me, 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 me. No, I talked I talked to you enough, it's fine. You did sound like that to be fair. You did sound like that to be fair. To be guys, back me up. You did sound like that. A little bit. He did sound like that. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. He did sound like that. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, anyway. Bye guys, see you guys next time. Bye. So baby, I hear the music calling, toss salad and scrambled eggs. Oh my. <laughs> what the? Maybe I seem a bit confused, well maybe, but I got you paid.